I got this motherfucking pussy Yonko talking shit like he could do something. I'm my mama, bro. Do this shit. Talk this shit in my face, bro. All this shit. I ain't no tough guy. I'm an anime nerd. Come on. Let me see you in Anime Expo 2019. Show me what the fuck you talking about. Talk that shit about my family, bro. We gonna see what the fuck is popping, bro. You s we see what's up, dog. I see you, bro. Say less, bro. You pussy as fuck. I'm glad like I'm not on Twitch or my shit isn't connected to Twitch because I had my shit streaming by mistake. You know, because oh, on Twitch, like when you are um, connected to OBS, like once you start streaming, it automatically just starts streaming on Twitch. Where through YouTube, you have to go and say start streaming. So, damn, that'd been bad. But um, fruit, what were you talking? We were gonna hear the good shit on Twitch. Oh yeah, the governor of Virginia, like some like old photos came out of him of like fucking him with like it was like a yearbook picture of like him in like straight up just blackface with like and there's another dude with a kkk outfit next to him there's like a huge fucking controversy about whether or not he should resign or whatever mm, probably, Damn. Should, probably shouldn't resign but resign. um oh you need his ass to get the fuck up out of here we could probably we dig deeper to make sure that you know yo is this is this is this real <laughs> yes you know, okay you know what the craziest part about that entire <laughs> What you saw the picture? <laughs> you said the governor, the governor of Virginia, blackface. Yeah. Oh my god, he dead ass blackface himself. Holy shit. Oh yeah, it's like it's not like it's straight up like. Yeah, I thought he. No, I thought he was gonna yeah. half pass it. Yeah. This guy went no, full like, on this afro. Like... He had a kangol on. He got the yeah, and there's a guy in shades. Yeah. Well, I gotta see this picture now. So he had the kangol on hey, too. Yeah, hey, did somebody change. link it or something? Yeah, yeah. chill out, Corey. <laughs> I can't believe y'all haven't seen this. This is like the big news story right now. See, this is what I'm talking about getting the fucking topics pre hand because now if you would have said this, everybody would have been like, what? Yeah, but now we're talking about it. Yo, what the fuck? Is this dead ass? This nigga is wild. Oh, no. Damn. <laughs> I guess we found the thumbnail. Bro, this, this nigga had the life. Wait, this is 1984. Yeah. Right. This yeah, it was when he was in high school. He's, he's in high school. I mean, come on. All right. I mean, this nigga's in high school. Yeah, high school. That's I mean, no, that nigga was wild. But like, no, come this, on, bro. bro, it's high school. Like, that's the shit that they were uh, back then. That's the shit yeah. white people did. I mean, it's yeah. not excusable, but I'm just saying, can we really it is hold up some shit that he did in high school? That's what I'm saying. It's excusable. Like, 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 what the fuck was we doing in high school? That's no, I wasn't saying. doing that, but like, well, I, wasn't thing, doing, I wasn't doing blackface. I yeah, I wasn't doing blackface, but like, bro, but we like, were doing some, we were doing face. some shit that was kind of like, like you gotta fuck up once in your, like, a few times pussy. in your life, bro. Like you can't. I mean, that shit, well, this shit is wild. Thing, the interesting thing about the whole situation is that, uh, actually, we'll just, I'll just save this until later if you want to no, talk about good. that. But, we, we jump right in. No, oh, okay. But he he pr the they did like a poll of like people of Virginia, like whether or not he should resign, and they did it by race. And like it was like out of all people, black people like wanted him to resign the least out of every like race group, which is like weird yeah. to me. Because we understand, bro. Well, I we think understand. nowadays some people understand if like racism, <laughs> domestic violence, okay. homophobia. Um, it's those funny. things, I don't think they're funny, but right. if you stand on the opposite ends of those things, you get canceled quickly. So some yeah. people, they're we black. We've been canceled our whole lives. No, but if, if it comes out that, <laughs> no, but that nowadays, if you come out as a racist, a public racist, you're out of here. Like if they can yeah. single out and prove that you're a racist, you're done. If you, if this nigga that you're look like a black done. Bruno Mars. Like, <laughs> no, bro, this nigga look like he's about to hang yeah, some he put tar on his face. It's wild. He, he yeah. really went all out. So, I mean, I'm not going to... I'm not going to... I'm at, trying to figure out what high school was this. Prior, just imagine, any imagine, white imagine high school in Virginia. Arguing. Probably just a regular ass high school, dog. <laughs> yeah, any white <laughs> high school. Well, yeah, it was in Virginia. Imagine arguing with this nigga. He's like, wait till you see my final <laughs> form. <And> he comes <laughs> <laughs> Nah, I, th I think like back that? then, legitimately, uh, it was just funny, you know, to him. Like, oh, I don't think funny. he needs to lose his job now, but he no, then no. he definitely deserved a stone called stunner, though. I mean, I think uh, they should probably, like, so. you know, a short leave of absence, <laughs> but definitely not losing <laughs> a job. 
from, nah, 19, something from 1984 when you were in, in high school? That's yeah, the thing that's, that's bro, happening too I'm frequently. Ma- bro, where people imagine again, you getting like the job of your dreams, right? And <laughs> niggas like, I remember you called that girl a hoe. Yeah. <laughs> a hoe in 2012. But high key, high right. key. I you think, out of there, cuz? High key, I think if you are if you have videos on the internet, if you get the job of your dreams, you probably should delete all those videos. But you should just delete your shit. <laughs> <laughs> <Obviously. laughs> Like, like, say, like, say, randomly, I became a senator, like, ten years from now. This, like, uh, <laughs> like, this, this. Hey, this imagine talks. if, like, for Neverworld became a senator. Oh, what's wrong with that? All right, Pull all up, right. Bro. Okay, so here's the thing. <laughs> While we here, um, we gotta apologize oh, for episode man. eight being so late. Um, we just had some, some scheduling difficulties some bitch niggas in the chat <laughs> fucking cory <laughs> some, guilt. some scheduling difficulties we're yeah. still waiting for one person to pop up hopefully Fuck fruit. Yeah. hopefully he does but um yeah so i'm kind of happy we waited a little bit because a lot of shit popped off after we would normally record <laughs> Uh, we'll, we'll definitely get to that because that was going crazy on the timeline. But I asked you guys about the. Um, do you guys know about the Vic Mick McNoya? I don't even know who this nigga is. He's the voice of Edward Elric. The, oh, the hey, dub. just explain the situation, bro. Okay, hey, Edward so, Elric. Shut up. Oh, yeah. he's the voice of Broly. He, him too. <laughs> yeah, oh. yeah, but he, he's most known for the Edward Elric. Who's Edward Elric from Full Metal, Al- Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood? On, oh, 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 I was like, bro, get this nigga, <laughs> yo, get this nigga <laughs> fuck out of here. <laughs> Who is this nigga? But <laughs> who the fuck is this nigga? Uh, so Vic, I don't even know how to say his last name. Mick, Mick Noya. Just Vic, just Vic. Um, to set it up because people said people, we, uh, you guys saw like some of the criticism we had. Corey, remember you sent it to me, Corey, where they said we don't yeah, introduce yeah. the topics properly. So yeah, this yeah, guy, sure. Vic, the voice of Broly, voice of Edward Elric, he has been accused by the voice of Bulma uh, of sexual harassment. Oh. And other voice actors are kind of standing with her. And you had other people coming out kind of saying that, you know, he's always been kind of creepy with them. You had a girl that posted on Twitter saying that, yeah, when she was like 13, he gave her a hug and kissed her on the cheek. Um and oh, that nigga's wrong. Yeah, oh, hold see, on, hold is, on. When I saw that, I was like, eh, "But hold on." I mean, but the thing it's is, creepy. But at the same time, it's like, are we really going right. to crucify the guy? In her, in, like, in her, in her story, she said she gave him consent to hug and to kiss her on the cheek. Right, right. Oh, dude, what's she talking about? Right. Okay? But what's happening now on the timeline? You have either kick Vic or I'm with Vic. But kick pe- Vic. But people with are Vic. ready to kick him. Um, I know. I saw people on the timeline because Funimation has fired him and said they would uh, no longer work with him after an investigation. So people are like, okay, they investigated. What? He did it. He's done. He got Kevin feige So uh, and also uh, another thing is, is like, we know how certain investigations go. That's when what I'm saying. Things, when it's like, okay, it's like, all right, this guy, he's so fucked right now. And the public, eye, we don't want to be associated with him at all. With right. Yeah, yeah, so my thing shit. was my, I, what I said to that post, because somebody posted, <laughs> I said, Hopefully, they investigate better than the NFL. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Because the NFL investigated... What's my name? What's the, what's my guy's name? Greg, Hardy. Greg Hardy? <laughs> Greg Hardy? Yeah. And he was good, apparently. But there are literally pictures of what he did to his girlfriend. <laughs> and that didn't matter. He was back in the league. So I can't just judge this man because Funimation was like, oh, we're done with him. And I can't just judge this man because a woman is like... Oh, he, first of all, she didn't he even did. exactly say what he did. She said, oh, the truth will come out soon or blah, blah, blah. She's kind of prolonging it and not saying exactly what happened. But people so are ready to cancel him. Evidence of like, if he, he's, re- I mean, he's prob- most likely. Probably a, creep- a little creepy, right? But like, he hasn't like. To what extent? Right, nobody. To what extent? Like, harmlessly creepy? Is that what you're trying I to say? I don't know. I, because. It, What's harmless? When I see him, right? He re- he harmlessly has- creepy is like your uncle that be like slapping your ass at the barbecue. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. I don't, I don't, I don't have an uncle like that. <laughs> yeah, slapping no, ass at the barbecue is not, is not. That's <laughs> creepy. Family event. That's creepy, especially uh, if you're a female <laughs> and your uncle. That's uncle's- harmless, dog. Right. That's not I harmless. Got, uh, this is why I don't I want, know. I don't want my brother smacking my daughter's no, ass. No, we get Ali's backstory, his anime backstory. Yeah, that's wild. 
But well, I mean, on my brother smacking my daughter. I don't yeah, want that. That is crazy when you put it like yeah. that. Oh my god, my brother, that's wild, bro. Yeah. But what I'm saying is, like, for him, when I look at him, he looks kind of. Hey, what's popping? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Matt, what's welcome. Happening? Hey, it's like what's man. happening, Matt. Welcome, uh, uh, welcome to the Grove uh, podcast. What's episode happening? Eight. What's happening? Y'all niggas wild. Bro, it's I about reaction smacking, is like when that black guy smacking, shows up on uh, the, in the court. It's like, it's like another uncles. black guy. And and then y'all, bro, fuck y'all niggas. Hold on, hold on, hold oh on. Oh, my God. Y'all niggas started this shit without me, and I told y'all I was going to be here in like 15 minutes. <laughs> bro, we <laughs> believe you, dog. Oh. Yo, even Corey was like, yeah, he ain't going to be here that time, cut. Nigga, I called <laughs> <up. laughs> <laughs> Corey, you're a hoe. He said to start it up. He was like, like you're fine. <laughs> Even Carlos like, yo, stop that shit up, guys. Y'all, look, look, look. All of y'all niggas yo. are some hoes. I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start on the line. I'm gonna start on the line. Froob, you a hoe? Oh. Quietly, you a hoe? Corey, you a hoe? Brago, bro. Wait, 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 wait. Ali, you a hoe? And Brago, you are a fucking the fuck super hoe. Yo, what did I do? Corey is like, yo, just start this shit up, guys. Hey, no, no, bro. No. <laughs> Why not these niggas, bro? Because that nigga's just say some shit. Nigga, be like, put cuz at the end. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? With the cuz, it's not that shit I It does make it sound like that was the Corey didn't say that shit. I literally just got, I got it here. Just how probably like five. Corey's like, Corey's like, I'm gonna pop and let y'all know I'm here. Just start that shit out, cat. <laughs> but nah. I was just like, hey, bro, what's up, bro? Matt, hey, Matt nah, welcome. Uh, welcome. Uh, nah, for real, though. What's up? What's up? Good what's to up? have you here. Hey man, how uh, man, hey, how, man. how is what the you, how is the you, party? What I you did... mean? What you mean? Good to have me, bro. Like nigga, I'm a I'm a regular on this whole dog. I'm a cast member. <laughs> yeah, no, you said you were gonna be in 15 minutes. It's been like 30, but no, good to have you, bro. Man. Bullshit, <laughs> 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 nigga. I was driving a hundred on the way home. Oh wow, that's Damn. dangerous, man. He out here committed. Wait, wait, wait. were you I drinking? Just trying to be a main hoe. Huh? Were you drinking? Yeah. Yeah, I drank earlier, but I I just ate some wings at Pluckers because I got like these little cars and shit. Oh well, that that, that solves it. Now. Yeah, <laughs> that solves What's it. Up? <laughs> you ate some wings. That's good. All right. No, um, I, I had I had like fifteen wings, cuz. Hey, who's you at? Who's you at Pluckers with, cuz? Bro, uh, does it matter? This girl, this girl, <laughs> named, yeah, dude. this girl, this girl named Lady, like, and that's her real name. Oh, like, that's not what she is. Damn, nigga, uh, like, it's not that many girls named Lady. You got at least forty bodies. Hey, what, her name Lady Bird or some shit. She yeah, does. nah, her name Lady, bro. She a little white girl, so you know I ain't. Oh, she like white. That. Oh, she gotta be yeah, bad, man. No, 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 no. I mean, no, no, no. Look, look, she's fine. She's fine as fuck, but she kind of because I know you don't mess she with kinda, white girls. She kind of big and she tall. What's so big? Like, it's like uh, like, like she she like more than two hundred. Oh, oh yeah, that is like, big. I, I, I promise you, she more than two hundred. I mean, oh, wait, 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 wait. Slow down, slow down, slow down. She could be thick. Nah, 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 she not, she not, she not, she not, she not, Brago, Brago, Brago. She not the thick. She not the thick that we like. No, but I'm talking what white girl. What are you thing. doing? Is the question. Huh? She's fat. Just say she's fat. Dog. Nah, you no, know y'all got to be more nah, respectful. I, no, if she was fat, if she was fat, I would say that. Yeah, she's that's fat. what I'm saying. She's not fat. So she's like fat, but what you think? A homie, like what happened? Because you using the white fat, girl thing. That's not. Come on now. Huh? You using a pluckers card? She white homie. No, nigga, I just gave her a pluggers card because like it's her birthday. <laughs> it, it, it's her birthday tomorrow. So like we went to this bar like across the street and then we was drinking a little bit. We was drinking uh like Ooh. this this shit had like four dollar shots of Jamie. So okay. I was like, shit, nigga, that's like nigga, you know, Jamie, that's that's the bitch right there. Cool, back so, to the uh, rapist. Duh. Yo, that's dope. So, um, so you enjoyed so, your night. So then huh? You enjoyed your evening? I, yeah, bro, I made some. Bro, money. I knew as soon as Matt turned in here, the whole entire fucking combo was just gonna go <laughs> completely into the dumpster. Yeah, yeah, bro, I, 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 I had a, I had a good, good little night, bro. But you know, the night Matt is young. a chubby chaser, though. Yeah, I got to watch. No, that. nigga, relax. Two hundred. Yeah, shout out to all, shout out to all my thank thick, you, my Ali. Thick women shouts out, out here, to man. Ali for one for one time only. Shouts out to Ali for saying thank relax. You. Um, wait, I didn't ask you other guys how how you. I don't think I said Quietly, quietly, you feeling better, man? Yeah, yeah, we good. Fruit. We getting there. We asked Froob about his raid earlier. Froob, was that successful or you guys are Fuck Froob's raid. <laughs> this, is, whole ass. this is continuing. Uh, Corey, how, how how was work today? Fuck work. <laughs> Did you damn. arrest uh, anyone? Damn. You said what? Did you arrest you anyone? Arrest? 
<laughs> pull, anybody, pull anybody in the station, man? You good? Oh, nah, bro, shit. Like, I fucked them niggas, though. Ali, you said you had a midterm. How was that? That nigga that lied. Nigga that, nigga failed. That, nigga that nigga failed. failed. That's what he said. He said, I got plus, plus. <laughs> That nigga lied. He was just Probably messing lied. with his boyfriend. No, I had a, I had two midterms. How'd it go? Oh, how do you, how you think it did? Uh, the person in front of me better have been smart. Oh, <laughs> <that's> the first <laughs> one. <laughs> All right. The second what one, the second one, I didn't really like need to do well in it, and I didn't do well in it. But I'm still gonna get like a decent grade. You know what I mean? Well, well that's all that matters. Good. That's so all that Ali, matters. Ali, what happens? What happens? Right by the very slim chances that why are you saying nigga, slim? Because listen, that the nigga in front of you it was dumb. That the you. nigga in front of you was actually listens to the grove and then he tells the teacher he's like hey man this nigga copied off of me bro mm. i don't want this nigga to fa- and it's then a girl, you fail it's not a nigga okay oh, nigga, mm. girl nigga bro nigga is interchangeable nigga he's just wanted to or- say nigga mm. okay I'm uh, saying. let's call them like niggets but um yeah. Wow! I know she's smart because <laughs> the way she was dressed. <laughs> nah, nigga, you don't get no pass for saying that shit. <laughs> yeah, like, we just gonna brush past that? Yo, yeah, we ain't brush past that shit. Nigga. Whoa, whoa. You got a wait, wait. So we wait. So niggas is worse than, than is worse than nigga. It is. Yeah, yeah, yeah that win. nigga's wild, bro. Think, because like, nigga, is. you can't change the rendition of the like what? <laughs> bro, okay, bro. Uh, let, let's let's. I didn't know that bro. was a thing. That's- if you call a dude, if you call a dude a nigga, <laughs> that's that super is canon. <laughs> yeah, like, let's be real, bro. We let this nigga make it with the with, with the n word sometimes. That whole come off so seamlessly, but we don't question that whole. But for that nigga to say, because yeah, it comes off seamlessly. But yeah, you we ain't gonna say let you say niggas, bro. You wild. What's I, what, why? Wait, what's niggas mean? Bro, no, oh, no it's bro. just the fact he's he's too comfortable, bro. He's too comfortable <laughs> changing. Like, he's too nah. comfortable changing the so words. You're saying bro. if he's no, that nigga, comfortable changing we, nigga, already, if you look, bro, so if he can change Braga, nigga to Braga. nigga, he can change nigga to nigger. Yeah. Oh, yeah. oh okay. Yeah, he already yeah. got a pet. Like, like, you got, look, you got the we, nigga it's questionable. The it, it's questionable. It's questionable in the first place that How? Ali, that Ali, <laughs> the Ali, isn't Ali like, like, Asian? like, listen, that Ali has a pass to say nigga, but like, nah, bro. And the only reason why he has oh, a pass to say, How only reason why he has a pass, born listen, here. listen, <laughs> only reason you have a pass to say nigga is because you're a part of the growth. That's it. <laughs> yeah, that's like, nah. Hey, that nigga Ali's like, I've been saying nigga before the growth. Nigga. That <laughs> nigga been a part of me. <laughs> All right, yo. Anyways, back to Vic, man. Man, do you know you about not, do you know about the Vic situation? Not many more people. Yes, Hello. bro. I, I well, no, 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 no. The only thing that I know about this Vic situation is the Yonko and for never, and I'm pretty sure we're gonna <laughs> save that shit for later. We'll, we'll definitely so, touch on that for sure. We'll just, uh, right just, just brief me, bro. Just brief. Me. So Vic, because. Vic, Vic is the voice of Edward Elric and Broly. Um, I know that much. So he uh, was accused of some, I guess, sexual assault by the voice of Bulma. And and wait a second, wait a second, Bulma. Edward, uh, Edward, that's um, that's the big nigga in the metal. That's one of the right? main characters. Though. Full metal. That's the, Full, yeah. I, I said that's Edward, I said Edward, that's the Edward big nigga in the metal. In the metal. I, I said yeah. that's the big nigga yeah. in the metal suit. Ali, Edward is the see? stain from the other planet. He's like buff as fuck. Wait, He's like, Ali, Edward, wait, Ali is already Ali is already taking. Wait, Ed is Ed is Ed is a short nigga. No, Edward is the super stain, right? Isn't Alphonse the tall nigga? No, Alphonse. No, you are right. Alphonse. See, I was right. Like that out. Yeah, and now take that L, Matt. I was right. No, nigga, you still, <sighs> bro. Alphonse and Edward are both like middle uh, or, or are both main characters, but, but there's one you. main I, I main know, character, nigga. I know what you meant. I know what <laughs> yeah, you meant. Yeah, so, so I'll give you. You that. regardless, give you regardless, that. he's you, Edward, right? And voice of Broly, voice of Edward. Um, but he's been accused of sexual assault, and Funimation has fired him and said okay. they will no longer work with him. They, they're not okay. going to work yeah. with him again. Um, so people are ready to cancel him based off the investigation that Funimation did. And they're yeah. saying because of that, we should believe everything people are saying about him. But you have people that are saying, uh, people are going online on Facebook groups and are basically embellishing the information that's out there. Uh, it had, right. it had a, a post on Facebook that said to, you know, Photoshop the picture so it makes it look like he's touching the girl's breast. Um, mm. and basically they're exposing the groups out there that are trying to kind of smear his name because they believe the voice of Bulma while he's coming out and saying, 
don't attack anyone that's trying to attack me. Like, we're not doing that. My thing yeah. is... Oh, he said don't attack anybody that's trying to attack me? Yeah, he said that. He said don't, don't do that. Don't don't do what that. a nice guy. Yeah, that's what he said. I mean, oh, I mean, that's, that, that's very stand up. That that's very that's very uh stand, uh stand upish of him if that's a word or if that's a phrase. We rock, we rock with but it. that's playing devil's advocate at the uh, same time. I can't. That's okay. like that's like saving face for yourself. Yeah, it's I can't. Like, go, go ahead. Go ahead. Go h- ahead. Nah, go ahead. I got, Damn, why y'all niggas speak? <laughs> and and Brago, Brago, I have to say something to you. But just remind me to say that later on in the podcast because it's going to be a funny moment. So just remind me to say. It. All right. Okay. I can't <laughs> yeah. say whether or not he did do it. I don't like know a lot about the situation, but I do know like just as a society, like once niggas start canceling a nigga, like most people don't even care about the situation. Niggas just be quick to cancel niggas. That's my thing. That's my that's yeah. the issue with today's society. And then, we and then like didn't Chris Brown and I br- uh, that's the example I brought up. I was like, didn't Chris Brown and <laughs> David Rose just get off on? Right, not Bro, saying that it's yeah. bad. and they got they got they've gotten like accused several Kill. times. I don't know if getting okay, okay, look, all they do is get killed, but there's no forgiveness ever yeah, here. Like, nobody ever comes back and says, My bad, accusations nope. seriously. Yo, I'm, all I'm saying is that, like, you, like, you know, people should look harder into those scenarios and, like. We can't just take somebody's word. We should take their word seriously, but it can't just be based That's off of all their I'm word. saying. I, I, I agree. I agree with what Corey just said. But look, this is all I'm saying about this situation, right? So I, uh, um, li- like, like I just said, I agree wholeheartedly with what Corey just said. Like, we yes. need to look deeper into the situations, and we need to not look at things at face value, okay? Mm-hmm. But, but, or not a but, but and. <laughs> And the fact that this nigga has a picture on Twitter. So I know we're not talking about this for Never World shit, but um, so the 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 tweet that for or the picture that for Never World quoted, right? This nigga is hugging on a girl at the time of the picture that the She's picture like was 13, taken. Right? That bitch was thirteen, fam. <laughs> Bro, if I'm 21, nigga, if I'm 18 years old, bro, because y'all know how I feel about uh, fucking with a girl that's younger than you after a certain age. Yeah. Bro, yeah. I would not be taking a picture with a girl like that, especially if she was young. Yeah. At 18, and, get along. Even, even if she even if she looked young, even if it was questionable to me. I would not you do that side, shit bro hug, because my yes, because it's the facade. <laughs> it's like, yo, uh, if somebody sees that picture, they're like, then they're the like yo, they what the fuck are you doing? Uh, yeah. Matthew, what the fuck are you doing, bro? Like, nah, bro. And so that, that's what makes me question it a little bit, but you know, yeah, I was like, yeah, you don't, you don't want to be like insensitive and be like, damn, that nigga ain't do it. And then that nigga just be out here foul. But at the same right. time, I hate that. Like, you don't want to fall like, on accuse someone of yeah. doing something. You know? Yeah, you don't want to fall on accuse this nigga nobody. like me. Yeah. It, I just, I don't know. And I can't, I don't want to tell you like not to be invested in it because it's not your situation either. Because so it, I'm, yeah. I mean, nobody's I'm telling you to investigate nothing. Things. It's like, like it, 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 I mean, what is it in court? It's like proven until you're uh, innocent until you're proven guilty. Mm-hmm. Innocent yeah. Until, yeah. Uh, yeah, innocent until proven guilty. But that shit's fake too. This shit, that's, yeah, not, that's not the same. Innocent, that's not the, the same thing in a court of public opinion. opinion. In a court of public opinion, you're guilty, guilty until, until you prove innocent. innocent. And, and even when you get proven innocent, innocent, it's like ah, whatever. You should have been in that situation. You should exactly. You don't even talk and shit like you do something. Oh my mama. Where you had to go to trial for some shit. Like, you shouldn't have been in that situation. But that's the. Uh, Bro, that, that's all the this shit. I ain't no tough in. guy. I'm an yeah. anime nerd. Take, Come on. Uh, Let me you know, see if, you in Anime if, Expo if 2019. Says, Oh yeah, this nigga touched me. Then niggas is gonna, is gonna be like, oh yeah, that nigga's, you know, that, that, nigga, that nigga's guilty. It's, it's not. That nigga touched her. And you just kind of rolling dice with that shit because like she could really be pointing out some shit. Like it's women who get offended or sexually assaulted and they can't prove anything and the shit happens and niggas <laughs> well, go away. That, that's, why a lot of, that, that's why I don't yeah. fuck with white girls. 
Uh, like, no, 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 no. It sounds a little racist, my no, guy. No, yeah. no, that's a not bit, I mean, it's a little bit blunt. No, that's not racist. Kind of no, right. no, fam, no, fam. That's not racist at all. A little bit general. That's just what the that, that's just what the facts is, bro. I will not <laughs> fuck with a white girl. I will <clears> not <throat> fuck with a white girl for that exact reason. I, wait, no, he's wait. right though, Carno. H- how is he? Right? <laughs> okay, Brago, I'm gonna give you. A, I'm, I'm gonna give you a scenario, bro. Um. So, like, let's say you fuck a white girl, right? Yeah. Let, let's let's, let's just say that was what. Let's <laughs> what? no, no, no. Listen, listen, listen. Let's just say you 21. You 21. So this is years ago. Yeah. So you're not compromised, right? All right. Okay. <laughs> let's say you go to a uh, you go to a party. You go to a, you go visit one of your homies. He in college, right? He, you know, he like, hey, bro, come come visit me in college. You know, so on and so forth. Yeah. We go. We gonna go to these parties. We gonna turn up. We gonna have some. You know, we gonna have some fun. So, as all colleges are, they're pre- or most colleges, they're predominantly white. So, you like, you know, you chilling, you shooting the shit, and you see this white girl at, uh, at you know at, at the party, and she feeling you, bro. You know, and y'all niggas is like hitting it off, and then you know you like, hey, uh, my homie. Like my homie gonna be chilling in here for a minute. Let's go into his car. I ain't got my car with me because I, I I I visited him. This nigga got a whole fucking. This is so specific. This is very. This hey, this specific nigga don't get to this. This is this is very specific. That nigga had so a then, location. So then you go you go into the car and, and then y'all niggas bang fuck, bang boogie right. Why y'all are fucking or yeah while y'all are fucking somebody sees y'all. All right. Yeah, and then she gets embarrassed and she fucking says she got a race. nigga. Yeah. And then she gets embarrassed. She gets race. embarrassed. She gets embarrassed. She got a nigga. Her nigga is on like the football team. All right. And yeah. He's a white boy. And then you like, damn. And then she like, oh no, this nigga raped me. No, this yeah. Nigga, or not, you could have told even, that story no, like look, three look, minutes look, slower, but yeah. <laughs> look, not even, not even as extreme, not even as extreme as that. But hey, this nigga put some shit in my drink. Mm. And I'm I didn't here, know what I was and, doing. and I didn't know what I was doing. Mm-hmm. Yeah. No. Yeah. Like you, like a girl gets like caught cheating, or like fucking like. Or if she got even if like fucking, aren't yeah, exactly. Or, 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 or she's just embarrassed, out, or yeah. she's just embarrassed at the fact that she's fucking with a nigga. But the specific- <laughs> same thing is to kill a mockingbird. Specificity- Literally the exact same <laughs> thing. <laughs> to th- kill a mockingbird. No, but Matt, the thing is, is you tell me a black girl can't do that. A black girl is a woman is more likely to do it if it's like if she's ashamed of like her right. Like black women could do that, but like Yeah. But I it's think more I, likely yeah. if it's, it's like you know, a different yeah, race. Like, I, yeah, like I mean I understand what he's trying to say. I feel like from a historical perspective, I've definitely heard more stories of like white girls doing like black people dirty as fuck. Like Thank you, Fru. Yeah, okay, you can say you've heard more stories about that, but I'm Yeah, but as far as like statistics, I have no fucking Yeah, yeah I, I can't say yeah, there's I have no like a, there, there's not no impossible. like factual there's no factual yeah, there's no evidence. It's only just word of mouth. <laughs> <laughs> of like it's only just word of mouth. When she was but I, I can understand the, yeah. the the perspective of okay, it's it's easier to see that happening with a white girl. You know, I get that, yeah. but I don't think that's yeah. the reason not to fuck with a white girl just because that could well, possibly I'm, happen. Well, I'm I'm just giving a look, look, look. I can only speak. I can only it. speak for myself. I can only yeah. speak for myself. I've only fucked with one white girl in my life. Um, Tragic. Um, <clears throat> lady. I mean, if, if that if that was to happen, Bronco, that's the relax. Case, <laughs> all you gotta all you gotta do is all you gotta do is say boys will be boys and you Gucci like that's it. That's it. Wow. <laughs> That's all you need. Wow. All right. Wait, so, all, right so, all right, Gillette. Yo, to wrap up to wrap up this Vic situation. Well, um, what do y'all do? Y'all think he did it? Did something? Oh, uh, that nigga probably. Uh, did I it. don't know. I haven't like. Uh, I didn't. That I don't know. No, I haven't done enough research on it to know anything. So. I mean, can he transmute a circle with no hands? So you don't know what the fuck. <laughs> I, I would say, I, I, like, like based off of what I've seen, I would say that that nigga's pro- like, like, okay, look, he. All of the allegations against him are probably not true, but that nigga's dirty. But that nigga's done something. He's done something. Yeah, he's done something. I think there are things that he's done that's probably crossed the line, and yeah. um, I don't think you know where there's smoke. Why y'all niggas think that though? You said why, bro? Well, I mean, it's it's just like, yeah. he has like a creepy vibe to him. So yeah, it's kind of nigga like, wishing, uh, bro. Yeah, nigga wishing. You look a little he creepy. Had a creepy vibe. Like, you why? can tell. Like, Let's look at him. Can tell where like the rape. Like, just look at him. You, you ever look at a nigga, bro? And you just be like, oh normal. yeah, this nigga. He got a little vibe like to him. And then even nigga. his video, he made an apology video. You know, he's crying. And then honestly, like I didn't know he was that old. Um, 
That nigga knew what he was doing. He's uh, he he's about to be shit. he's about to be sixty, yo. But Damn. for him and I wouldn't say that though, Corey. No, I mean I don't I don't think I'm not gonna judge him just because he looks creepy. I'm not. That's what I'm saying. I'm not saying he's guilty, but I'm going to wait until hard evidence comes <laughs> out for me to that say the that's that's all. I'm not about yeah. to be yo cancel Vic, kick Vic. Funimation doing what Funimation does. I'm, that makes sense for their business. Yeah, it makes sense. That's, that's what they do. I mean, okay. As so a this company, is you thing. immediately have to distance that's yourself it. from even the accusation. Yeah. You, and you have to, as a company, stand on the side as, as, yeah. as the person, as you know, the accuser. Basically, yeah, they got to do what they got to do for Funimation. So them doing that does yeah. not mean he's guilty to me. Right. And right. a lot of people but are they using that. Say, but they like say, we're gonna wait. We're gonna hold off. We're gonna give. We're gonna wait. We're gonna wait until. Nah, they can't say that. They can't say that. We can. We can. Because yeah, like can. the public, can, can. the public could just say, "Oh, Funimation Nation dropped this nigga. Oh, this must be true." Because all of a sudden, Facts. like yeah, all yeah. of a sudden, like say, say the Grove gets sponsored by Apple or some shit, right? All of a sudden, you're on yeah, Apple right. platform. Give me some AirPods, bro. And then we find out that Ali, out Ali out. was out here in Utah, <laughs> like Fuck. fingering chicks in their ass or some shit, and they underage. <laughs> <laughs> no, they underage. Oh yeah, <laughs> um, yeah you, you gotta say that. First. And then all of a sudden, yeah. I gotta we gotta put out a statement and say, "Yo, Ali's no longer on the podcast, yo." Just even if we even if we don't verify it, <laughs> hey, you gotta, hey, then they gotta come on with a new, you, app, you, with a new you, app, just for the views. You don't give a fuck. No, we got bro. We gotta kick you. Nah, bro. If we get that grotto, we gotta kick you, cash. We gotta kick you, bro. If we, we got the apple sponsor. <laughs> See, dude, yo, this is how it happens at the actual offices. They're like, ah, we gotta, we gotta, we gotta get, get ready. Yeah, this is how you know, yo, a bunch of fake. <laughs> yo, if it come, I just, I yo, like, nah, we gotta, we gotta sign with Microsoft and give like Apple the big F you. you bro, know Microsoft ain't gonna, Microsoft take, us ain't gonna take us with you. You finger <laughs> underage girls. Yeah, you got that. Ali, Ali, if you go to court, if you go to court and it comes out that you won, we bring you back as a guest at first. Then you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know, we gotta we gotta baby step you. Baby step you, step in, you know back mean? in, dog. You know what I mean? That's just how the business that's works. Some whole ass bro, shit. <laughs> bro, I'm just saying it's like, that's just the business of it. You know what I'm saying? It's so, like how you kinda like baby like baby step your side that's chick kinda to your like, family. That's kinda like the one piece podcast a little bit. How they kinda you know what I'm saying, Roger? Like they was oh, yeah, like, like Roger, <laughs> they? not for Ooh. real. They they like they stopped Ooh. messing with Roger because Roger was reading the illegal scans. Now all of a sudden I saw somebody tweet like and they quoted Roger because Roger's now a presenter for Crunchyroll. And he said, um, oh, and they said, if you don't read illegal scans, you're going to lose your audience. I'm like, him presenting for Crunchyroll has n- not a thing to do with fucking reading the scans. Scans. It's just a reach. But anyway, it's just like, that's just the business of it, you know? And Yeah, but to go back movies. a little bit and also sway into our topic, when you were talking about how like... Uh, like people just say like fucking like believe the victim or whatever like that's how like the whole fucking for never and yako thing got started on twitter because for never was like pretty let's much i don't know the whole context, let's okay so let, let's explain the situation for that so audience. with the vic thing oh, with, um yeah. that that conversation so the thing is with the vic thing at first i really didn't care about it because it was just yeah. like i didn't know enough i just I saw know, i just kept yeah. seeing things so then i started digging a little bit and i saw but then it kind of came to the forefront when for never world he kind of quote tweeted uh, this girl, the 13-year-old girl that Matt was talking about, and uh, Vic hugging this girl, and they were unusually close. And Fenevero says, wow, I mean, he could have just been acting nice. What do y'all think? Which, in a way, is kind of insinuating that you don't believe it, and that, you know, it's like, he's guilty? That's what you're trying to say, really, that he's guilty. Yeah. Look at this, 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 you know what I'm saying? Look at this shit. And Yanko says, nah, bro, don't do that. Don't, please. Why are you quote tweeting and directing an audience that will provide nothing of substance and value to the conversation? Rather than focusing on what they think it's important to listen to, people's stories and understand the consequences of your platform. You wouldn't have seen this tweet if I didn't reply and went out of my way not to retweet or quote tweet it because I know people who will defend Vic without having met him just because they see an SJW agenda or some other bullshit they've been force fed. It's a lot. Yeah, <laughs> and I, I'm just going to be the first person to say this shit. Yanko was way out of pocket. Yeah, I agree. That shit. Well, I thought you said he was out of pocket for saying the shit that he was going to say next, mm-hmm. not for what he says there. No, no, well, I think no. he's out of pocket Yonko, for even saying that. Yanko was out of pocket for trying to tell for Neverworld, 
hey, bro, like, 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 nigga, how are you going to tell this nigga what, what his audience is on his Twitter? Yes. And yeah. then and then how you going to tell the nigga? Mm, um, I don't how, know. How, look, how you know how you going to tell the nigga, bro, your audience isn't going to. Isn't gonna um, provide anything. Of, like, isn't gonna provide anything. Look, that's that essentially. That's probably true. Essentially, he marginalized <laughs> for Neverworld's audience. Not because really. Their anime. No, wait, yeah. wait, wait. He marginalized for Neverworld's audience because they're anime fans, and he says he he essentially said, "Yo, because they're anime fans, they're just gonna pardon <laughs> him for these allegations." And that's bullshit um, because we're an we're anime fans. I don't right? get it that way. I didn't take it that way. Uh, yeah, I, I kind of. Bro, said, that's like, what I took it I mean, as. I, mean, I, I kind of took. I, I mean, that's part of it, but also I think part of it was that he was just saying for Never's fan base is just cancer. Yeah, I, I think, thought he was going nah, specifically at the no, fan base. Can't, can't, that's you not what he was saying. Generalize though. a fan base. That's you not what he was saying. A fan he was base. saying. I just felt like he was just saying like the way that you bringing this shit up. It just sounds like you just doing this for like. Comments and shit, and this is a serious situation. That's how I consider nah, it. I don't that's, think that's, you're, you're no, right, right, bro. No, no. Look, how can he, uh, bro, uh, Matt, Corey? How can you come? Uh, okay, go Matt, ahead. Go ahead. What okay. he was saying, I think what Yonko was trying to say is that honestly, nobody that Fenevero, audience, they're not mm-hmm. going to provide anything of substance or value because they don't know what happened. So honestly, quote tweeting it and how it was done. It's just going to add to the toxicity of it because but people Braco, are just going to say, yeah, but you also have to understand, Braco, you, have to bring in the context. you have to bring in the context, but it's, prob- like, oh. it's true though. No, nah, that's not true. Well, you tell don't me, know wait, tell me what substance not. and value they can bring. The, the substance they don't know and value that, yeah. the, look, the it's just going to add to the value. flame that's been at that's on social media. Mm-hmm. That's okay. It. But and, how and do, also how the Neverworld did it where he was like, wow. I mean, he could have just been acting nice. It, it it just seemed like he was like it's kind of instigating like, the situation. Red, it I'm, like he was I'm gonna say, a I'm, yeah, I'm a gonna say, bit. I'm gonna say that for Neverworld, for Neverworld's, for Neverworld's a little out of pocket as well because right under the tweet, like like so the tweet that he That's quoted, you know, you know, the, you know, you know, it's what, tough. I say this the, because how he said it. I don't know how he meant it, right? He said, "Wow, right." right I mean, he could right. have been it acting was, nice. I'm not. I'm not sure if he's being sarcastic or he's really <laughs> saying yeah. that. I don't it, it know. Was, it was left. It was definitely. Uh, no, he was it was definitely left for, he for wasn't? interpretation. I don't no, know. No, no I, I don't. I don't think that he was sarcastic. But the way that he said it, it was like it can be taken out of context. So, though, it right? was, yes, it can be taken out of context. And like I looked at it, and I'm like, bro, come on, for never because like right underneath the quote or right underneath the tweet that he quoted the girl literally said like she replied to the same tweet with like three more tweets yeah so it's like okay look for never you just looked at this tweet you just looked at this picture and then you didn't do any further research after that so i I can understand mm. yonko in that sense but what i'm saying yonko was out of pocket on is the way that he came at for never world Okay, I agree. And with that. for Neverworld I was agree. out of pocket. For Neverworld was out of pocket <laughs> for leaving it. For leaving it um, so it was kind of yeah, yeah. Without, so yeah. open ended. Yeah. Yes, that's okay, it. I so they were both out of yeah, pocket. Yeah, yeah, I think they I think were both I, out okay. Of so for Neverworld could have been more, uh, I guess direct, my, more direct with what he was thinking at that time or saying at that time, and Yonka could have DM'd him. Use emojis, nigga. Yanko could be. No, no, y- Yanko, <laughs> Yanko. Yeah, I, I feel. I feel like Yanko was out of pocket, just in a in a sense, like like just he was way out of pocket it because just came it's like, bro, like, you, you know, wouldn't have know. that same energy. Just look. Let's just call a spade a spade, bro. You wouldn't say that shit to that nigga in his face. Say that to my shit. Bro. I, well, I, I, I don't know. I don't know, know Yanko. No, 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 I don't know Yanko's Brago, background, so I don't. I don't want to. I don't want to say that. Brago, Brago, I'm saying in the sense like how hostile he was. Like, so look, the first tweet he says, "Nah, bro, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't please." Yonko and then the second the tweet, bro, <laughs> this nigga just came straight out of the like, like just straight out the gate, bro, for like, like okay. swinging for the fences. Okay. No, okay, but I think you guys are completely like not. Like taking what like this whole like I don't know I think you're taking what Yonko said out of context because I think what Yonko said was like way out of line and like I think you're like interpreting what he said like differently than what it was because okay. he was pretty much saying that like for Never World your fan base is cancer and they're just gonna defend Vic to the end because the 
the word he said is they see an SJW agenda or some other bullshit they've been force fed. So he's pretty much saying that, oh, you're just going to defend fucking uh, Vic because you just think that it's a bunch of fucking SJWs and that the story is not real, blah, 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 blah. That's pretty much what he was saying. Yeah, Fenebro, uh, Fenebro then responded and said, bro, it's called There's Two Sides to Every Story. I'm not going to exclude someone f- from having a platform, and I don't give a fuck. I'll unfollow you, bro. Fuck out of here with that shit. Don't come at me like that. Address me privately. So f- from that, Fenebro was not being sarcastic. He was just providing this, all right. He could have been, been being nice. And Yanko yeah. was like, nah. It, yeah, it so comes yeah, I'm saying. Yeah, like, like, Yonko, it comes like, off pretty as like Yonko. Yeah, like I don't have anything to say about him, but it just came up like you know how like you got a problem with a nigga, you just waiting on a nigga to fuck up. Yes, yeah. that's literally what it's like. Yonko was ready to be a boat and shrimp on the ball these oh, nights, man. <laughs> Yonko, that nigga, that nigga Yonko was like waiting, waiting, uh, right next to the fire with the meat. Like, where's the meat, meat bro? About to throw some shit where's the meat? The Where, like. where's the, <laughs> hey, in, in this case, in this case, where's, where's the, the meat? <laughs> um, but then, it, then, it, it, then it went all the way left, right? Um, and nah, it, it went all the way left when Yanko responded, bro. Nah, it went left when niggas started doing memes. <laughs> Yanko, so like, because Fenerbahce said Yanko. something else about his audience. Um. After he said, bro, it's called two sides to every story. Oh, he said, and please don't insult my audience again by saying they provide nothing of substance. I have no idea who you think you are, but please don't disrespect my followers like that again. I'm allowed to retweet whatever the fuck I want and show <laughs> both sides to a story. Have That's an awesome facts, day. Though. That's facts. One thing I didn't wait, understand wait, 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 was... Wait, 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 I'll go right there, though. I just had to... Because when I, when I was watching that, I was like, so... <clears throat> if niggas came that niggas in your chat, like, mm. you, going, you going this hard... Like, nah, Braga's not doing it. I mean, if, they, if, if someone okay, says, okay, like, the BDA is, community uh, is shit or something like that, he Braga might say something. Braga would be like, yeah, them niggas trash. Like, well, the thing is, it's like, it, it depends on, like, what they're coming at me for. Like, if I, like, say I'm, I guess if I'm offended by it. If I'm offended by it, then yeah. But if it's just, I mean, like, somebody saying, like, oh, BDA is cancer, all right, whatever. But, I mean, to put it in, I think for never was just offended. To put it in, put yeah. it in better into context. What if Brago quote tweeted that saying, "Hmm, I wonder what the whole story is." And Yako said, "Brago, shut the fuck up. I don't want you and your BDA like uh, faggots yeah. like coming over here and ruining like Whoa. the whole thing." It would be like, you yeah, know, that'd, that'd be, be like, that, yeah, I'd be a little offended. I'll be a little offended. So, that, <laughs> yeah. so that's what I'm saying for him. <laughs> after that, Yako then said, "What audience?" The ones that left after you build for a shitty rap career? Oh, my nigga, yeah, my nigga, and, he was, shy. He was, and, and, and Yonko, Yonko was bullshitting on that part, right? Wait, hold on, hold on, let, let, me, let, me get, okay. let me get the whole, <laughs> get the whole tweet out. Shots. He go said, ahead, what ahead. audience? The ones that left after you build for a shitty rap career? And the reality show you couldn't get off the ground? Bang, Good luck bang. finding sponsors for your keeping up with the Fenevers coming, coming never. Bang, and now you try to be a bootleg drama alert? Good Dang. luck and peace. The nigga unload yeah. the clip, Cass. So, so Yonko, <laughs> y- Yonko, Yonko like was that. bullshitting on that because, like, okay, let's be real. He here. didn't have to do that let, nigga like that. Let, no, no, no. Let's just be, let's just be all the way 100. But never was it like, who the fuck is this yeah. nigga? This nigga, this nigga <laughs> like, was just like, bro, Yonko, Yonko for Yo, one, Yonko fuck? had that shit. Yonko had that clip. Had that shit on his he had heart. that clip loaded for a while. He had that. It, yeah, bro, he had that clip loaded for a minute, and then, <laughs> let's be real, I think Yonko is getting beside himself, and I feel like a lot of people have felt like Yonko has been getting beside himself, but Ooh, the thing is, is that every day, <laughs> <was like>, bro, <laughs> let me say, let me, bro, let me, let me finish. No, 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 I was being genuinely curious, I don't know what that means. Okay, I'm, I'm a, I'm a tell you. All right, go ahead, go ahead. God damn, Yonko, bro. like, like, niggas, <laughs> niggas on so Twitter right. have felt like Yonko has been getting beside himself for a minute. But people don't like for never world. Pop, like it's the popular thing to not like for never world. Yes. Now, and what yeah. I mean by Yonko has been getting beside himself is Yonko thinks that he is big because he has a lot of followers. No nigga, on, people only follow you for the information that you link, or th- for the information that you leak. I mean, people don't follow you because. You're because you're just uh, this staple a personality, you know, or because you're this personality. No, nigga, don't get beside yourself, fruit. That's what I mean. Um, okay, that, yeah, nigga's yeah, getting yeah. Bes- that nigga's getting beside okay, himself. But, but to be fair, but to be fair, like, to be fair, like, like that. They, to be fair, though, Matt, like, I mean, he kind of built the platform, right? 
Brago, that's true, but he built the platform on the basis of him leaking information. Right. People follow Yonko for the information that he leaks, right. not, not for him. Not necessarily for like for his credibility. The, 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 oh, the perfect example. The perfect example. Not of for that him as a personality. Is, the, 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 the perfect example of this is whenever Yonko said, "Yo." If I release some merch, oh, man. Oh, will y'all buy it? Not again. <laughs> nigga said, on, nah, man. bro, this Come is, on. bro, nigga, I'm, bro, I'm just giving you, I, I'm, I'm just telling you what the fuck it is. Son the monster. Nigga said, <laughs> he didn't have niggas, to do that. niggas was he literally that. laughing at this nigga, bro, oh, because my. they, they're like, bro, you got <laughs> the audacity to ask us if we'll buy some merch man, from you? Man, catching some Yonko smoke that, tomorrow, man. They bro. just said, no, come on, bro. <laughs> no, no, nigga, did you read the tweet? <laughs> bro, did you read the tweets and did you read the memes after I that nigga tweeted poll, that? <laughs> all I no, saw was a poll. No, nigga, man, nigga, fuck all I saw was a poll. That's all I saw. The poll. Bro, fuck, fuck the poll, bro. <laughs> Look at the tweets that were under the poll. Look at the thread that the poll, like, bro, come on, man. Y'all oh, oh, niggas try to yeah, save yeah, face. You you had had to do that. I don't give a damn. I don't give a damn, bro. Because I don't give a fuck. Hey, oh, man. Nigga pulled a like them niggas did this like nah nigga you said that oh man, man. I ain't gonna that so that's funny right that's funny because that happens all the time where some shit happens in the stream or in the video like yo bro i heard you said that I, the fucking poll i'm like yo what yeah, I remember <laughs> <that> <laughs> yeah he said i said some shit i'm like yo what i didn't say that <laughs> but um nah okay so yanko unloaded the clip saying yo what audience then for World came back says good luck with cashing in on illegal translations Bet. Ooh. Let's see how far that goes, boy. You want to play with me? I got you. Say less. That seems like I'm about hey. to snitch a little bit. Like, hey. I'm about to spill on everything he do. Hey, what I'm was that shit? Right that nigga people. posted something about fucking somebody, bitch. Like, Hold on, bro. we'll get to that. We'll get to that. We'll get yeah, to that. Yeah, that nigga was bullshitting <laughs> on that. Bro, I, I, oh my I think god! That, I think that like trying to out him for illegal scams and benefiting off of it is like, bro. Like, I don't know. Like, that's 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 not cool. For like, never defend. He, he but he, he doing some, yeah. He for never fight, shoot, so. but Yanko came out. Um, I guess Fenevero was trying to DM him at the same time, and uh, Fenevero was saying, uh, I guess suck my dick, and Yanko was basically saying, <laughs> Yo, why did you? Why are you trying to um, censor yourself? Censor shit and dick. Um, yeah, because. That nigga kept putting like one instead of the eyes. Yeah, like, that shit's gay. That? that shit's whack. <laughs> like, that shit whack. I was like, yeah, yeah nigga, why are you? Nah. Yeah. Why um... are you censoring that shit? That shit's gay. <laughs> Maybe he feel like he got a younger audience and he's trying to, like, nah. you know. Bro, but we don't know, bro. But if you put a one there or an eye, we know it's gay. So, so, so after that, Yonko said he really thought he was going to get a show. Uh, crying emojis, crying, laughing emojis. And he said, he really trying to DM me. You got shit to say. I'm right here. I came up with respect at first. Whoa, but I can't discharge oh, some disrespect too. <laughs> yeah, uncle, that wasn't respectful. That wasn't respectful. That first, that, nigga said, Fuck that, that first nigga. back and forth, that wasn't respectful at all. That was like, my nigga, I don't this like you. Braco was fucking Joe Button. No, he one wasn't. Thing, one thing I didn't understand was like, uh, for never said he came at his family, but I didn't yeah, see I was, nothing. I guess the family was the yeah, yeah, keeping up uh, with the for never is coming never. never. Keeping his, up with the for never. Oh, that's, what he was that's about. fine. I thought oh, he was like relating his followers. Yeah, I thought he was like, oh, we a family here. We no, no, no. He was talking. He was talking about whenever Yonko said keeping up with the for never. Oh, this thing. And I mean, to have a reality show. Yeah, but after that, so I don't know if you guys know who Afro sent you is yeah i see the name I don't so afro send you while this was going on he kind of jumped in it a little bit and it was like a little side story going on while yonko and forever <laughs> was going on him and the bleach guy him and james, james hansen james. got into it a little bit because afro send you while this was going on he was pretty much like yo for never you just gonna take that like defend yourself and <laughs> that's when for never came out with the video saying yo <laughs> Afro send you, you put this battery in my back, but yeah, Yonko production suck my dick. And then I that's when the famous on my nah, mama bro video came. Hey, can I can I say bro. can I say can I say this too? Bro, oh, my for mama, never world, bro. For never world, nigga. You are not from the south, bro. <laughs> Don't say <laughs> oh, oh my mama. Bro, you can't put bro. it on. How do you know he, he not? He can't put it on his mama. You any from wait, any from Florida? Nah. Nah, nigga, you did. He did not sound right saying "on oh, my mama, bro." At so it's kind of like it's kind of like it's kind of like Ali saying "nigga." That nigga sounded. That nigga sounded <laughs> like up. that. That nigga sounded. 
That nigga that sounded nigga like sound he like was the less crying. Gangster version of uh, Blueface. He sounded like he was crying before Yo, he chill. put that shit out, bro. Like, nah, bro. Niggas, bro, if you use some slang wherever you're from, bro, just Cash. make sure you're saying that shit right, bro. Because, like, that shit did not sound <laughs> he also, right yeah, at all. He also I was like, like, like that nigga said, yeah, oh, 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 He also I'm did not say, say less right. He didn't say it the right way. Like, because that's what niggas up here say when they when, when say, say, say less. Say less. The ar- yeah, say less. Like, when the argument is over, it's like, nigga, word, that's what you want. That means, that means, I'm about, that means action is coming after this. There's no more words. There's no more words after that. Yeah, what did he say? Why did he say like say less? He said say he less, say? then went on to speak more words. You can't say less and then go say more things. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, say less, say hey, less, bro, say less is the totally, end of it. That means when I see you, I see you. Like, have you guys seen the meme? It's on the same tier as lace up your shit. Have you guys seen the meme? Right? When uh because that shit had me fucking rolling. It was like Triple H <laughs> pointing at <laughs> pointing at the, pointing at the rafters in his AX. <laughs> Yo, that shit took me out. <laughs> oh my god! Hey, bro, bro, you know what's even funnier oh about god. this, bro, is that it's WrestleMania yeah. right now, bro. Like niggas are pointed at the no. WrestleMania side. No, but like, what Seth, Rollins, Seth Rollins just won the Royal Rumble, bro, and oh, like literally yeah, the god. Monday night, the Monday night before this. Bro, this nigga pointed at the WrestleMania <laughs> side. But it is the, the the WrestleMania side that they have in the meme is the WrestleMania side from this year. So I'm like, bro, <laughs> these niggas, yo, these I gotta say this wild. to Twitter. Twitter moved quickly, right? Quick. They said we bro. run. They went and they had the fucking <clears throat> memes on deck. They made you the Dragon Ball videos. Me, it was just yo, um, what's his name? Laz <laughs> reposted Matt's video. I said LA about to be a movie this summer. Like <laughs> niggas was out here. <laughs> and honestly, hey, somewhere hey, out of nowhere, anime fan talk came into the mix. <laughs> <a little bit. laughs> Yo, shout hey, out to AFT, because AFT had me rolling as well. What are you saying? Brago. Brago, uh, go, go look at this meme. Y'all look at this meme that I'm about to send. I don't know if y'all see this shit, bro, but this is funny. But then but then did you guys see people try to like they fucking altered the video that Fernand World did? Yeah, they distorted, yeah, they distorted the, the audio. Saw raccoon and Goku. Oh, the Raccoon and Goku one. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Wait, did y'all did y'all see the fucking shit I posted in the chat? It was like the it had more retweets than the actual fucking Which one original was post. It was like the fucking guy with like the distort yo. I made coffee. Who wants coffee? Yeah, yeah, who wants because because the thing is, um, what's his name? Barack Obama. Every time something happened, he was like in the fucking right beneath the tweet saying, yo, who wants coffee, yo? I bring more coffee. Like he was fucking instigating. And after a Yonko tweeted his shit, Afro Sendu put the um the green mushroom. He said, damn, man, just gonna let Yonko do this. Get back up and go get that nigga. <laughs> he said, like, he yo. killed him. But the thing that really one up. <laughs> the thing that right, the thing that really um got for really? Neverworld was when Yonko said, um, he said, you're trying too hard. Don't speak on shit you don't know or shit you don't want. People or shit you don't want people to know will come out. Then he said, mm. um, the thing that Face he said, watch. he said he capitalizes every word, but he couldn't capitalize on his career. That shit was whack. That shit like he didn't capitalize was, on his career. He's bro, like one niggas, of the big niggas was hy- he's niggas doing. was hyping that niggas was hyping that shit up, bro. That shit was so whack, bro. That shit was corny. I'm starting to think Matt don't Yonko. like Yonko. Nah, bro. Uh, if I was for never, I had to no, fight that nigga. No, nigga. I'm just call- bro. Look, look, look. Then he look, said, he I'm said, calling- hell ain't looking so beautiful anymore. I, I'm Damn. just saying, I'm just saying what it is, bro. Like, look, I've been ragging on for never. I've been ragging on Yonko, bro. All of this shit is corny. But you and Yonko, but you and for never got a collab plan. No, we don't. Yeah, <laughs> no, we don't. Yes, you do. No, we don't. Yo, nigga. I saw, nigga, look, I saw the tweet. For nigga, never was like, have, for never was like, yo, whatever, yo, let's make that, that, uh, that fucking, uh, song. He was like, yo, all you gotta yeah, do is nigga. ain't nothing but a G thing, baby. Bro, no, bro, go, I didn't say that shit. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> ain't nothing bro, but a G thing, bro, baby. Bro, you bro. wanna know, you wanna know what happened after those tweets? Oh, uh, shit. What happened after those tweets, man? Nothing. Bro, that doesn't mean nothing gonna happen. For never was just ain't ready for you bro. yet. Bro, look, no, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing was ready to bring that. He just ain't ready for you yet, dog. 
Bro, oh my mama, Broncos, bro. He ain't ready for you yet, bro. Broncos, <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> but nah, um, the Young Queen for Neverworld thing. That shit was that shit was Young hilarious, niggas man. Wilding. Nah, nah. Okay, look, I just want to say one more thing. Okay, so you said that this nigga Yanko was like he didn't capitalize on his career, rap career, bro. If we're being if Uh-oh. we're being honest. If we're being honest, right? Mm. For Neverworld, mm. the only mishap, <laughs> the only mishap that this nigga has done with his music is the fact that he has been promoting it on his anime channel. Hey, if he would have made a separate channel for his music versus his anime, then he would be golden. Like Yanko think like like Yanko is trying to make it seem like this nigga is supposed to just pop. Out of nowhere, and it's like no nigga. I understand like, bro, that perspective, n- bro. You're, uh, bro. If anything, Yonko hasn't capitalized on his anime career, on his Damn, anime Matt career. Yonko, because yo, do you like this nigga? Yeah, bro, like, I've I've known Yonko yeah. since like 2013, 2014. What happened? I don't have on I don't have nothing what against. I ain't, got nothing against Yonko. Yeah, I, I ain't got nothing against Yonko. I ain't got nothing. Look, I ain't got nothing against Yonko. I ain't got nothing against for Neverworld. I'm just saying, bro, this shit is just out of pocket. I, I feel Yonko is way more out of pocket than for Neverworld because Yonko has been clearly holding this shit on his chest. I and can see that. Just now saying this shit. So I'm not that. fucking with that shit. That shit fake. I can see it. We're gonna have Yonko on the next episode so he can kind of just talk this out. <laughs> I mean, I don't care, bro. Like, let that nigga be in here. Hey, Matt ain't so gonna show up that episode. It's yeah. gonna be like that chibi shit. Oh shit, man. Yeah, <laughs> Corey, Corey, really? Really? Hey, you, you threw the live. I had to finish that whole had to duck Nah, it. nigga. Nah, nigga. Um nah. Wait, before, Yo, before, that, dude. before we get <laughs> off, like niggas chibi on Twitter wilding. Um, the James Hansen Afro Senju, like basically Afro Senju was saying that James was talking shit about a Forever World and he called him a snake. Um, but that whole situation, I thought Afro Senju was just like he was waiting for an opportunity to like expose that. Where it's like, uh, it's kind of whack. But then they went to like a private Discord and discussed it. I was like, yo, if you're gonna come at you publicly, y'all gotta have that debate publicly. They didn't have it publicly. Yeah, so then, you are. I, I ain't the way, for real. The way the way no, for real, it. bro. If if you if you if you saying you're exposing me as a snake and we can debate anywhere, nigga, I'm about to debate you publicly so we can prove that what the fuck you were saying was not true. Like I'm not. How come you ain't get on Ty's stream when he was trying to expose you, Ty? <laughs> yes. No, I, no, after the third one, I was over it. And plus, Ty, well, Ty, why you get on no, but Ty came out and said, oh, after people said I wasn't going to be in a reverie, I made two more streams just to troll. That's what he said. I'm so, hungry to wow. bitch. That's what he said. Um, but to my nigga um, AFT, um, he came out of nowhere with this one. He said, um, let me just say this. <laughs> oh, no. At Rogers Base, you ain't shit. You dead ass <laughs> called yourself the burning blood champion when your name ain't on the leaderboard. Get the fuck out. And you... At Afro send you five years ago. Yo, I just realized he said five years ago. <laughs> five years ago, you said these games would never be competitive, but here you are sucking on Jump Force, fucking hoe ass. <laughs> <laughs> he just came out of nowhere with that. Um, hey, bro, we definitely have to have like a read and tweet segment. Like I, every, every, I don't episode. know what happened to AFT. But um, he been hanging around some niggas at but, school. I'm telling. I told hey, you. I shout out to my guy Frank. Man. Remember, he said he's part of BDA now. Shout out so to shout out to my guy. Shout out to AFT man. That's hey, my nah, guy. bro. He got a lo- he got a little black honey in the cut, bro. That nigga I, getting too. The thing bald. is, I think is. I, I, think, Yo, I think it was just funny. I, I don't know how serious it was. I think he was just fucking around, but I, I thought it was hilarious. I thought it was hilarious. Bro, that, I just saw that. I was like, damn, what Roger do? Um, to wrap up the Fenevrol and Yonko thing, Fenevrol then came out and said he was um, because Yonko kind of threatened to expose him a little bit, expose I'm the sorry, things he bro. did. But Fenevrol came out and said, yo, it's, it, before you expose me, let me just say I've had a lot of threesomes. Uh, I've had sex with a lot of dudes, girls. Um, <laughs> I, he said in particular, I, I like how you had to clarify that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he said I was smashing um, a, a girl around the time a friend came to visit from the UK. And I don't know if you saw my James Madison <laughs> at the time. I don't know what the hell was going on with that. But yeah, then, I don't know. It was just, it was just like I don't know what that came from, but I guess yeah, that's the thing Yonko was talking about. But yeah, at the end of the day, Twitter kind of gave Yonko the W off of the exchange. Um, I mean, I, he was more disrespectful. Getting, he was anyone more like, is getting the yeah. W after fucking for never posted that fucking. I think video. the video that did. The, I think the video. Did. That was the worst video I think I've ever seen in my entire yeah, life. Yeah, for he eld himself. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah, like <laughs> I think the biggest thing from this shit was that like. 
I realized that like you know like when shit happen like they go viral like it be like the like the internet and but like anime niggas move real quick like this wasn't like it's regular the niggas internet, these nah, were anime, anime niggas anime niggas but the thing is like Matt said niggas, <laughs> like, be, niggas be waiting around for Fenebro to mess up like niggas yeah. just be waiting for him and it's like bro I saw so many memes talking about oh you ugly you ain't he you ain't handed niggas nobody. the clip and niggas was just waiting to go at Fenebro I'm like yo like Y'all yeah. been waiting to go at Fenever. Like it's just he's just not liked anymore. Yeah, but I can see like if you're not Fenever like World really has into never been liked. I can see if you're not really into his con- content anymore. I feel like there like, was a moment. There's no he reason to like where he was like him. No, Brago. Bro, he, yeah, he had yeah, yeah, like I liked him yeah, the first time. Yeah, Brago, yeah, Brago, Brago for the for the general consensus, right? For the general consensus, people don't like for Never World. Why not? Because, like, after you've been in the community for, like, let's say more than six months, mm-hmm. you don't like for Neverworld anymore. The hell? Your I wasn't rocking with months, him when I first seen him. Your, that was your me first, personally. your first six months, you, you like him because that's the first person. <laughs> that's the first person that you see. Him or Sawyer is the first person that you see whenever you come into the anime community. Yeah. And yeah. after that, <laughs> a- after that, like little honeymoon period of like you watching for Neverworld's videos, and then you realize, like, damn, bro, this nigga really's not like he don't go in depth. Like, I know yeah, a little bit for more you. than this nigga. <laughs> then he God, like dude. after you, you realize he not yeah, it. Too. But I also think like damn, <laughs> I, I don't. Think fuck a part with of it nigga. also is just that the community, it kind of influences niggas you because niggas wagging. start going like, yo, for Neverworld's trash, and it's just. I think that seeps into it a little bit. I'll- I'm 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 gonna say I'm gonna say one Mob more mentality. thing. Far, yeah, I, I'm gonna say one more thing as far as the for Neverworld thing. Where so so y'all niggas like don't just think that I'm ragging on this nigga Yonko because I feel like I've been uh, dishing it out uh, to both of them. But Not for really. Neverworld tries to like put himself on a pedestal because like I mean it seems like that nigga just now started getting pussy. Right, like if yeah. y'all pay attention, uh, I know what you're talking about. If y'all, if y'all niggas pay attention, bro, <laughs> like that nigga be talking about, oh yeah, bro, I get pussy, I do this, I do that, like nigga, that's some shit. But Matt, but Matt, but Matt, I think nigga. that's the appropriate comeback. I think, well, he feels no, like it's, it's not. No, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. I, I think he feels like it's the appropriate comeback because for the longest time, people his people used to clown him by saying, "Go outside." That was, yeah. that was I feel you. So but, for him, he's like, nigga, I'm outside nigga, getting I'm pussy. Getting pussy. <laughs> okay, okay, but Brago, Brago, look, look, look. That's the that's the critique. That's the critique but, that but, everybody but Matt, says. To I think the anime community has anime. evolved a little bit. I think that's no longer a fucking um diss because it's a, you know niggas in the anime pussy. community is getting pussy. N- but nah, it's some niggas in the anime community. I'm not saying niggas. Most in niggas the anime are. Come on. Nah, uh, I, I don't want to say, say no names. I'm, I'm not gonna say that. I just gotta keep I'm, not, I'm not finna say. I'm not finna say most niggas. Do you bro, think Rogers because, getting look, pussy? Huh? Roger probably is. I don't okay, Roger, Roger, bro, is Rogers complete, getting pussy. Yeah. I don't, Roger got a girl. Do you think Tekken? Do you think Tekken is getting pussy? Roger. No, no. Tekken's a virgin. No. Wait, I don't is think Tekken's getting pussy. Tekken I thought he said he was a virgin. I don't Tekken, think Tekken, if Tekken I, wanted I to, think... he could post a fucking no. poll. He could he'll he post a poll on girl. Twitter and say, yo, like, pull up yo, to PA. Yo, yo, okay, okay, okay Matt, Brago, Matt, Matt, you think Brago, Chibi's getting pussy? because of, no. Bro, Chibi, Chibi got a girl, <laughs> nigga. Fuck you me, bro. Chibi's out here getting pussy. What you talking about, dog? Chibi's out here getting pussy, bro. Brago, Brago, this is what I mean. Brago, okay, let me put it like this. Let me put it like this. No, let me put it like this, bro. If we Bro, were to go pussy. to the bar, yeah. if we were to go to a bar as an anime community, oh, I can tell you niggas that would niggas? not. I can tell you niggas that would not get played, and I can tell you niggas that would Matt, get played. That's not the demographic, though. What if we go no, to a con, n- nigga? <laughs> nigga, <laughs> nigga, but look, pulling all the said, You said you said niggas that get pussy. Bro, yeah. if you get pussy. You should be able to get pussy in any environment that you go. I don't to. think that's not necessary. You gotta pick your spot, though. You Yo, gotta Ali about to get p- get pussy nah, from the gaming fuck bitches. That shit. You you <laughs> talk, you talking about pick your spots? <laughs> you talking about pick your spots? No, nigga, you should be able to get pussy where. Wherever you go, bro. Hey, if some you niggas get it can like only that. shoot threes, bro. No, nigga. That's, that's what I'm saying. Stupid. That's dumb. Some niggas are niche. Some niggas, 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 niggas got no, some, no. some niggas are niche. No. Some niggas are corner special. No, bro. Yeah. No. Yeah. The thing is, the thing is, Matt, is everybody, getting girls, everybody getting isn't, girls everybody is a isn't, sport. doesn't have an all around Everybody's nan type isn't specialist, Matt. 
Get in girls. Everybody's men okay. type isn't specialist, man. Get in <laughs> girls. <laughs> is a sport. You should some niggas are manipulators. Girls. Some niggas you are emitters. Sport. Okay. Put some niggas are enhancers. Girl. Hey, let me say. Oh, okay. Okay. So look, y'all, y'all niggas are saying then mm. you should be able to use your nin efficiently in any situation Match-ups. that you're in. Matchups. Matt, no, Matt, 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 Matt. Bro, <laughs> Matt. come on, man. Matt, you know some Nen, excuses, some Nen bro. matchups are just too much. Bro, Wait, Matt, you Matt. should be able to use your Nen efficiently. But Matt, just enough. because just because you can't use your Nen in every scenario doesn't mean you're not a good Nen user. I didn't say Ooh. that you. I didn't say that you can't. I didn't say that you can't use your Nen in every situation. I said that in every situation you should be able to use your Nen efficiently. Bro, where's some no, but just nerds, but Matt, bro. you can use your Nen efficiently <laughs> and not beat the guy. Or the the woman. Okay, okay. Yeah. Look, look, look. The goal, the goal is to just get play. I know that if we were to go to a bar, some of these niggas that y'all named would not even take a shot. But Matt, what I'm saying, no, no, I hear that. But I right, let's pull shooters up. Shooters gotta shoot, but nigga. Matt, Matt, but pull up to a condo with these niggas. <laughs> They ain't gotta shoot. They ain't gotta shoot. Even if you pull up to a car. Yeah. Even if you pull up to a car. Are we really what acting like fucking doing this? Are we really acting like, like, really acting like Tacking is pulling up to the con and just slaying every fucking pussy? He's no, 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 no. What I'm saying is he doesn't have to because of his popularity. You know no, saying, bro, bro. He gonna stop. pull up. They gonna be Come jumping on, in the bucket, cuz. Bro, y'all <laughs> niggas are giving y'all these niggas too much credit. Y'all in the anime community. Yeah. No, y'all are giving them too much credit, bro. Bro, bro you no, you sleeping nah. on Tekken one on one. Yeah, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Okay, I'll sleep. I'll be sleep. Like this is just this, this is the way I think. This is the way I'm. This is the way I'm looking at it. I know. I know. I'll be able to pull a bitch if I was oh. at the anime con. If I was at. Uh, motherfucking, if I was at, uh, a bar, if I was at Six Flags, if I was at Arby's, if I was at, (laughs) if I was at motherfucking, if I was at Timbuktu, nigga, I'd be able, I would be, if I was at a mosque, nigga, I'd be able to pull a girl. Oh, shit. I would be able to pull, look, and then, then then your Nen type must be specialist, man. uh, Look, bro, this is the thing, this is the thing, bro. (laughs) It's not about, it's not about just pulling a girl. Like, bro. You can you there's there's W's in victory or there's W's. God uh, damn it! Wait, so you're saying <laughs> yes, it's a W there's... even if you don't get the pussy? Yes. But I'm saying no. But Tekken yes. te- 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 can definitely talk to a bitch, bro. The, what I'm saying, nigga, I'm not doubting that he can talk to a girl. That's getting play. I'm doubting if he will. Tekken? I think Tekken will. Tekken would. You don't think Tekken has the balls to go up to a girl and say what up? Bitches at Dollar Tree? Bro, Hell Froob, yeah. Froob, Froob. Let, let's use Froob as an example. Yeah, let's use Ali no as business. an example. <laughs> and then, nigga, let's, bro, let's use Froob and Ali. Okay, if we, go if the girl, we go to, bitches. if the Froob goes to the, if if we go to the bar and mm. it's the Grove, bro, I don't think Froob is talking to bitches until he gets drunk. <laughs> and then that's part of and the, that's then part, we that's gotta tell ability. and then no but wait <laughs> and, then, and then and then look 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 we gonna have to egg him on a little bit we just gonna have to be like man fruit go talk to her bro just like what's wrong bro, with that you bitch yeah that's why you got homies right yeah that's what we did for nah Nah, you ever seen nah, you know nah, like nah, Bello nah, Betty, nah, Bello Betty's? Look, uh, I wouldn't have to tell. What? I wouldn't have to tell Brago. I wouldn't have to be like, "Hey, Brago, go talk to her." Brago would be like, "Shit, I'm Damn. in that thing." Hey man, relax. Hey, man, hey, man, too loud. Yo, stop. Even Corey, even Corey. But this this is Corey here recently. Corey, oh, I shit. wouldn't have to tell this nigga. Oh, I here we go. Tell- Air out the laundry. Yep, yep. Let's no, hear it. I'm just saying. <laughs> I just said. I just said. This is Corey. I said this is Corey here recently. Yeah. Two years ago, Corey wouldn't just go walk up to a girl, and I like that nigga would attest to that. Corey, shit you had a training arc. Well, Corey, after them yeah, stage yeah, performances, yeah. Corey, like, yo, I'm that nigga. Fuck you, mean. Yeah, you know, <laughs> you, sometimes you gotta pull it out, son. Put on the table, son. Hey, no, 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 yeah, I'm gonna tell, I'm gonna tell you about this. No, I'm a, that, that, that's like, this, crazy. this is the best oh, way. This is the best out. way that I can describe Corey. Corey was that nigga, but he didn't know it, and that's it. Mm. So he was cute. He was that nigga. He was that nigga. He was that nigga, but he didn't know it. I bet you, if me and Quietly, like Quietly, I would be like, hey, like, like Quietly, let's get on some hoes. Quietly, shit, let's go, bro. 
Quali gonna whisper in Matt's ear. Quali gonna send this to Matt. Save all the dirty ones for me. <laughs> One stipulation, bro. That's the only stipulation I have. But nah, bro, Matt gonna uh, be like, as long as the big bitch is for me. Yeah, that's <laughs> so look, look, bro. Uh, in, in short, in short, Don't look, say that. it goes, it goes to the same philosophy as I bro, say Ali, about yo. like niggas, about about niggas and fighting, right? Like, yeah, ten niggas might run up, but is ten niggas gonna touch you? No, man. Nah. Yo, Very I saw great. the funniest fucking video on Twitter the other day. It was like, it was this this dude, this Spanish dude fighting this big Spanish dude. And oh, the and big, was like, jump in. Yeah, the big Spanish dude smacked him. And the, the short dude was like, yo, jump in, bro. And he was like, like nah. nah. Nah, nah, just jump in. Jump in, bro. Don't, don't worry about it. Just jump in. Like, he cannot fight. He just had his niggas around him hyping him up. Hyping him no, up. All his niggas was like, jump, like <laughs> nah. He was looking at his niggas like, like jump in, bro. Me. Please. I was like, I was like, nah, on. them, them, du- them dudes wasn't really his homies. Nah, they're they not his homies. Jump. You yeah. can't let your man go out like I mean, that. But you, but uh, t- you can't let him go out like nah, that. Devil, uh, the play know, devil, the play see you the jump, and Corey, the play, Ali, I'm saying Ali, the play, Ali, devil, no, to nigga. that nigga's probably talking shit too, and uh, like. <sighs> Ali, you can't just jump like like nah, bro. Listen, listen. You can't listen. just jump a nigga. There's just one you thing. Fight. Look, look. There's honor. There's honor in and there, there's and a certain honor that you gotta have <laughs> that you gotta have in fighting, right? So yeah, it like like me and Corey. If Corey fought a nigga one on one, Corey would whoop that nigga ass. And okay, what if he did it and he said wait, jump no, in? No, nigga, wait, wait, nigga, <laughs> wait, wait, Corey's wait, 130 let pounds. Let me finish. Let me finish, bro. Let me finish. Look. So let let's Ooh, just like Corey. Would fight nigga. <laughs> Corey let, let, let's say let's say Corey Corey fight a nigga, bro, and then he whoop this nigga ass. Yeah, bro, I'm gonna beat that nigga ass after because I'm like nigga, why the fuck? Like why the what fuck? What kind of shit think? is that? Hold up, yeah, hold, up, hold, up hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Why, like, like why did you even think that it was acceptable to try and fight my partner, bro? Like, no, my nigga, nigga, why did you just so, do yeah. that at the same so, time? So then? look, 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 yes. look, no, 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 nigga. It, because that I gotta let my nigga get his one. I jade on that nigga. Now that nigga yes. getting jaded by and then now, <laughs> like, 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 so, so look, Corey, Corey whoop his ass, and then yeah, we gonna jay him. But if Corey fights him. And then Corey, like Corey's getting his ass whooped, and then Corey turned around to me, and he like, Matt, help me out, <laughs> nigga. I'm gonna be like, nah, nigga, that's you, bro. Like you fight that nigga, and then after the one on one is done, Damn, then I'll can, be like, I, then I'll fight that. Nigga. Wait, Matt, 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 then I'll Matt, fight Matt. Him. What if this nigga's six five two thirty? If he's he bro, he bro that look, nigga. if he's six five <laughs> and he's two thirty, bro, I'm putting my like, tractions bro, on. Bro, if Corey, if Corey was pressing that issue. And Corey, yeah, I gotta like, see that nigga you know, by myself. Yeah, bro, you gotta that. take that shit by yourself, bro. Like, nah, nigga, I'm not finna help you because look, nigga, you can't be no matter you can't the be case. Charging niggas you can't pick up under expectation of so your What if Corey's getting you. whooped like um fucking uh bro? Listen, I'm like not, gone if, if versus nigga, Hanzo. If, I'm not. He's not gonna get whooped. If, but if he's not that's what I'm saying. This nigga's whooping your ass like you done lost teeth. My niggas are fighting, bro. If my nigga is fighting one on one, yeah, I'm talking. He's getting his ass whooped. Okay, and he's getting his ass whooped. I'm not, and the niggas not let him yeah, tap out. He's not letting him tap listen, out. Listen, I'm not. I'm not gonna uh, <laughs> listen. I'm not gonna jump in. I'm gonna like. I'm gonna try to disperse that, and then I'll yeah. tell that nigga. Square well, niggas like, yo, sit your whole ass Look, back. I'll just no. if, the, if that nigga say sit your whole ass back, then I'm a pop his bitch ass. <laughs> like, <laughs> I mean, he's like, I got your ass, ass next. Down, I got your ass next, <laughs> I'm nigga. Over your ass next. <laughs> Yo, that's the wildest shit. Nah, if I see my nigga really get his ass up, I'm like, yo, stop, stop. Yeah, it. you gotta stop. Yeah. I gotta stop it. I'm stopping it. Yeah, exactly. That's what I'm stop. saying. Corey's I mean, getting his ass whooped. Really... You gotta jump in, nigga. Nah, he gonna, yeah. he gonna stop it, but he ain't gonna jump in just off the second me get my. Nah, nah, I would either. I'm gonna so, stop it. Honestly, if my, if my man's getting his ass whooped, then I might have to. We had to jump. That's thing, what I'm right? saying. I can't let my man go out like that. Like, have to like if a nigga ass, just man. like what he has like the upper hand, like I'm gonna break that shit up. But if the nigga's just whooping my ass, I might have to jump. That's down. what I'm saying. He's whooping his ass. He's six, he's just, like, six like, five two three. Nigga, like, I might have to just like catch that nigga up from like a different angle or something. Bro. I don't know. All right, man. I don't know how we got in that. It's situational, bro. You just know when you're in it. Wait. Um. Anybody watch the Grammys? I watched. I didn't watch. That was it. I didn't watch um, it. Right. So we're all winners. That speech made me go out and run a quick mile. So he was talking that real shit, yo. He was. He was. He was he 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 just, why, shit, why do you hate Drake so much? Cor- Fru, that shit was not corny, bro. You just hating on this nigga Drake. So here's the no, thing. Wait, let me let me go let me go through the, let me go through the winners real quick. All right. So um, 
Country album of the year we don't give a fuck about. Album of the year we don't give a fuck about because nobody we know won. Um, Who won? Casey Musgraves. Oh, um, oh okay, okay, okay. That's a good one. Yeah, Golden <laughs> Hour. <laughs> who the fuck is that? <laughs> <laughs> who the fuck is that? I don't know who that is, but um, who Casey <laughs> Anthony? <laughs> um, record of the year. Casey Nice that. Record of the year, um, This Is America won, Charles Gambino. Shout out to that nigga, Charles Yeah, it Gambino. won over, uh, it, what's it? It, was it won movie. over, um, I Like It by Cardi B. It won over The Joke by Brandy Carlisle. It won over God's Plan. It won over Shallow. It won over um, All the Stars with Kendrick. Rockstar, Post Malone and 21 Savage. And The Middle by Zed. Um... Song of the year. This is yeah, this is like this one that we're missing. It, it, it was song of the year was okay, this is America okay. as well. He won song of the year and record and uh, record okay, of the year. Okay, well then this is the thing. It quietly what you just said tells me what it should have won. It should have won video of the year, not record. Of the year. Oh well, yeah, that is true. What's it's the difference the between yeah. record and song? I think that's is it record of the year video. No, no, I don't think yeah, so. Yeah, it is. This shit sounds like the same thing. Yeah, record of the year is the video. Is yeah, it? honestly, yeah. honestly, in hindsight, I could see the record video. Of the video. Definitely winning video of the year, yeah. but not the actual because song, record song. of the year had like uh, God's Plan, which which I felt like was a good video. I like it with Cardi B and Rockstar. Yeah, I think I think record of the year is like kind of like video of the year. Okay, that's if that's video if this of the is year, America, then yeah, it should have won. Yeah, yeah, and it, and it won is, song of America, the year too. If this is America, is like a three. Without the like, if it's just a three listening to it, the video makes it like a ten. A ten, or a yeah. The video. Like, definitely that's makes that's it how a 10. much the video yeah. bumps up. That, I don't think it was song of the year. Personally, I think it was a video yeah. of the year. God's plan should have won song of the year. No, nah, yeah. I, I think it should be sickle mode. Wait, do they even have Facts. song of the year? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, the, what, what was song of the year? What was so, nominated? Um, all the stars. This is America. Um, boot up. God's plan. In it was all the stars. No, he, said, God, he said, "This is wait, America booed up, got okay." Yeah. He said, "No, this is America was well, record booed, and song of the yeah, year." It won that's both. It won both. It won both. Yeah, that's why I said yeah. I was confused because what the fuck's the difference between record and song? Yeah, I think record is the video and song is just obviously just a song. So, um, yeah, booed up was nominated. All the stars, I really like that shit. Um, God's plan, yeah. um, and other shit like the joke in my blood, the middle, shallow. I don't know all the other shit, but those are the nominated. middle by who? Um, Sarah, Sarah Aaron's. <laughs> Just meet me, Sarah Aaron's. Um, I don't, oh, okay, maybe, yeah, maybe it's that. that. Hard. Yeah. Yeah, I've been hearing Okay, it okay. Like All right, that does a good song. Um, that whole, that whole was on Target. I think Target really brainwashed us with that. Target whole. did have that shit playing on. I don't even know how I know that song. Best new artist. Um, This is what it says, by the way. It says, record of the year recognizes the artist's performance as well as the overall contribution of producers, recording engineers, and or mixers. Song of the year recognizes just this songwriter. Yeah. So I guess, yeah. I guess, I mean, yeah, I guess it's, the, it's pretty self-explanatory. Yeah. Um, best new artist, um, Chloe and Halle was nominated. Her, um, I like Georgia it. Smith. I think those are people. We do a leap of that one, right? Do a leap of one. I don't know who that is. Who's that? Who the fuck is that? Over uh, Chloe and Halle. Damn. These things look like I is like English, English chick. To the to the, to the Grammy like committee. Electric is one of her songs. And then... it, but her had the best R and B album. So yeah, I was like, her. Her won the best R&B album. Laughing. So, Chloe and Halle's album was actually straight too. Shout out to her. Um, best solo performance was Lady Gaga with Fuck Joanne. Uh, I don't know. I think I, honestly, I think um, I the only song I knew here was Havana by Camila Cabello. Yeah, that's the only thing. I, that's, that's the best pop solo performance. Um, best pop. Yeah, yeah. Best pop vocal album was uh, Ariana Grande. <laughs> Grande. <laughs> Grande. Um, Grande. She won for Sweetener. Um, the other nominations were like Taylor Swift and Pink and Shawn Mendes and Kelly. We don't know these niggas. Um, man, who cares? What was rap album? Man, of the we year? know who Sean Mendes is. I don't know who that is. Um, rap, rap album of the year was Cardi. Best Cardi. rap album went to Invasion Facts, of Privacy Cardi. with Cardi B. Um, what? Yeah, bro, that shit is going to Yes, yes. Um, I think so many people are personally, personally, I think it should have went to Travis Scott. It should have went to Swimming Pool or uh, I, 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 it should have. It should have went to Swimming Pools. Or, uh, like, oh, it, oh it, it it Matt Miller to, definitely shouldn't have won. It, it should have went to wait what? He should have went to Mac Miller or Travis Scott. Why? You, no, you said it. it you said he, to Why should Mac have won? Because he dead? Because he's died? No, bro, his album no, was no. It wasn't better. Wait, Mac Miller, Mac Swimming was was better than Daytona, and Victory Lap. Yes. 
Yes. No, yes. No, I told you it wasn't even good. Nigga. Nigga. I listen to the Mac Miller. Okay, so I listen to the Mac Miller album, right? No, 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 no. Let me let me say something really quick, okay? Listen, I am not trying to be disrespectful whatsoever when I say this, but nobody really cared about that album until he died, straight up. Like you can't No, no, you wanna no, you wanna no, you wanna know you wanna true. Know what it is. Shout out to Mac Miller. I don't want us to come off as insensitive because that's not what we're saying. Yeah, yeah, I'm not I'm not trying to be Okay, okay, so let me let me just rebuttal let me just rebuttal to what Froob said. Okay. I agree with that and I don't agree with it. Okay? Now where I'm gonna agree with that is yes, no one did care about Mac Miller until he died. Because they're like, damn, like this nigga makes good music. Because let's be real, does Mac Miller make bad music? No. Okay, no, not really. right. Average. So then after he after he died, people were like, damn, like let me go listen to some old Mac. Because let's not let's not sit up here in front. That nigga Mac Miller, that Vince Staples, uh, Our Future, that was all. And Mac Miller curated a lot of that wave bro because he put a lot of them niggas on okay if you go back and you look at all of them niggas that you know what what they say about mac miller it's oh this nigga put me on this nigga took me on my first tour this nigga let me come over to shit, this then, house shit, then scorpion should have won then right record. Uh, <clears throat> okay i just feel no, like what i'm saying no, is no, drake wait, drake wait, drake wait. put a lot of look, niggas on their first tour no, I'm not. I'm not saying. Look, I'm not saying. I'm not saying that he should have won simply because of that. Hmm. I'm saying that niggas went back and they reminded themselves of how dope Mac Miller really was. Okay, and so it, like, it gained the popularity of the, his death made people go listen to the, the album, and then people his, and then people finally said, "Yo, this is actually a good album." His his death, yes, his death made people go appreciate his music more. They. They went back, they went and listened to his music, and then they're like, damn, like, I forgot about this nigga because, like, I mean, he's just been around for forever. Wait, so, okay, so but people, this is actually a dope wait, 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 right. album. People were mad because the Grammys invited Mac Miller's family and he didn't win, which I'm like, okay, no, just I'm a not, nomination, just a nomination is an honor. Honestly. Yeah, nomination is so, a big and thing. then they would invite you out just in case he won. Just because you're invited does not mean you're going to win. Yeah, right. right. I, 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 I personally, I personally feel like Mac should have won that because literally, bro. Yeah. Like, so Divine Feminine, right? That was when Mac really. Uh, so, so he's always been melodic in a sense, and he's always somewhat. uh, yeah, somewhat, yeah. somewhat, right? Um, so whenever he got Divine Feminine, you know, he was fucking with Ariana Grande. Mm -hmm. And I I think that she, I I think that she really (laughs) helped him. I think that she helped him, uh, and like, like with his melodies in a sense. Okay. So that was like, that was the beginning of his evolution. Then when you have swimming pools, like literally bro, that was a quantum leap. I feel like in like Mac Miller's music, like. Divine Feminine to Swimming Pools, if you listen to just the way that that nigga structured everything, bro, his, the, everything, bro, he made a jump, he made a leap in his music, in the way that it was structured, the way that he crafted it, Mm -hmm. and I really feel like that nigga really found his sound on that album, Mm -hmm. and that's why I was just so distraught, that's why I was like, God damn, bro, like it would have been a great guy, story. Bro. It would have been a great story. It would have been a great story. What I would say, bro, is I, I like Cardi B, bro, and I felt I recognize like her hard work, but I felt like she deserved like some shit that she got. But like, at the, I feel like some of it, like the album of the year, she should have got. She should have got an album. Yeah, no, she should have like, got an album of the year. She should have got an album of the year. Like you guys, you got to think about what fucking came out this year. You got fucking Scorpion, Kod, yeah. Sick or not Sickle Mode. Astroworld. Astroworld was even nominated for album of the year, which is crazy. Yeah, was like, yeah. Yeah, was like, I really like Astroworld. Yo, even more like, even more like underground. I, not even underground, but like when you all know what I mean when I say this, like fucking Redemption, like shit like that. Like, yeah, why was a Sickle Mode nominated? Why was a Sickle Mode? We're talking about. We're only talking about shit that was nominated. Why? Why was the yeah, Sickle know, Mode nominated for is, Song of the Year? Huh? Sickle Mode. Because I mean, it can't. So, so the reason I think one of the main reasons was because of the cutoff. 
So Sycamore okay. came out in but but, uh, but September. But he's what, but he's nominated for best rap album for Astro World. Oh, oh well, no, okay. it is I under, it was nominated. Look, for I, song I, of the year. It's, oh, best rap song, not song of the year. I I understand. Best rap song? I understand. Yeah, that. but God's plan got it. No, wait, hold up. Oh, oh okay, 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 okay. Yeah, it's God's plan, yeah, yeah. King's Day. But that's what I'm saying. It should have been. It should have been on there for song of the year. No, nah, I don't think it was song of the year. What, bro? What you the numbers? I mean, you gotta think like. Even though I kind of agree with you, Brago, like when it comes to song of the year, there's, there's like a lot more that I don't know. But I'm talking about the, yeah. even for numbers, it like was insane. I mean, I guess yeah. I guess they have their own criteria, but I don't know. I just felt like and, Sycamore. And was, like the three beat changing. Man, that really shit was that crazy. Shit. But, I um, felt yeah. like Win should have won over that. Win? Yeah, Win was my shit, but that was just me personally. It probably shouldn't have won over guys playing. I, 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 Win yeah. shouldn't have won. It, it should, probably guys shouldn't have. I mean, I like, think I with, with what was nominated, it was it would have been Sycamore or God's plan. Just Yeah. I, I'm surprised. Yeah, I'm surprised. Can't, well, I'm not surprised. I'm surprised it wasn't. Did like, Mo Baba get it? Hell no. Hell no. They're not giving, they're not giving oh, Shaq West no fucking Grammy. <laughs> Oh, and, he about to be, and he about to be can't. I just had to ask, you know, there's the people, the Mo I mean, Bamba supporters he, he, out there. He, he, he shifted the culture. <laughs> you know what I mean? And Shaq West, supporters. he about to be canceled too, Heike. But we'll talk about that next week. Um, <laughs> well, we will, we will let that play out a little bit. But um, best um country. I don't give a fuck. Uh, so yeah, God's Plan won best rap song. Okay. Best rap album was Cardi B with Invasion of Privacy. Best R&B performance was um Her. So her won yeah. a couple Grammys. Baby. Um, I'll just say this. Um, did you guys see Alicia Keys and how she did? No, she I didn't like, watch it. We said we didn't watch it, though. Was it wasn't bad, it just she wasn't was like, The thing Why is, like, she, she came out and she was just, like, being positive And, you know, normally for just, those things, you want some jokes at the beginning. And yeah. she's, she's not positive that people. Auntie who was, like, somebody auntie at a house was like, oh, yeah, hey. Yeah, she's I'm like, yeah, she shout out to, you know, I see my friend here. I see, yeah. look at my guy over there. You guys just oh, look all so beautiful. Everybody yeah. just shining today. We just, like. Preaching positivity. I was like, she wasn't right. bad, bro. She, she just was cool. Wasn't she like, was cool. She wasn't like an entertaining host. Nah, like she was like a hospitable host. Yeah, she was cool. She was just cool. I mean, what is it? she is the backup, right? Like it was supposed to be Kevin Hart. No, Kevin Hart was supposed to host Oscars. Oscars. Oh, uh, uh, yeah, not the Grammys. Not the Grammys. But Kevin Hart. Eh. I don't know. I don't know. But it was fine. It was fine. Um, off the fucking Grammys though. Um, we we got some shit to talk about. We wanted to end this early, and we we already fucking. In what? a lot longer than I expected to. Um, all right. When we ended the last episode, Twenty One Savage had just gotten arrested. Like the next day, <laughs> the next yeah. day. Uh, I thought Fru was fucking with me because Fru put in the chat that Twenty One Savage was arrested by ICE, and I was like, "Get the fuck out of here! That's not true." <laughs> and the as the day went on, and people started like saying, "Yo, this Maybe is actually what ass. happened." I'm like, "For oh, real?" Shit. And <laughs> when they said this nigga's from England and then they started pulling out the memes, I was like, Oh, the memes. Oh, like, the, the memes and, and the shit like the, the fucking the surf, musket, dog. Oh, <laughs> my the surf, God. The, the third Savage of the 21st. The, right. That shit had <laughs> When they dead. said, yo, this is what Savage meant when he was talking about the red coats. I was just like, oh my god! And so I went. Uh, they had him writing with the the quill when they say that's how Twenty One Savage yeah, writes yeah. his verses. <laughs> yo. Um, oh, yeah, yo, that shit was crazy. Uh, backlash. Uh what's the name? Demi Lovato got attacked. Yeah, because she was like, yo, the memes has been the best part of this whole Twenty One Savage story. And, and like, then whoa, Wale whoa, whoa, came. Wale was like, yo, um, what? You gonna do that shit after when you did your thing? I was like, all right. I was like, y'all going a little too far. <laughs> Everybody was laughing at the fucking bro, memes. It was, bro, they even started making memes. They made memes about, of her. They started making memes no, about. I don't care about like. About I don't care about the memes that they made back at her, but there were people that were like legitimately angry at her for that was like stupid. being like, I can't believe yeah. you had the audacity to do That's this. Stupid. Blah, 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 blah. Why are you like, making it, jokes? This isn't funny. Bro, but the like, thing is, because of this situation, a lot of it, 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 spurred, it spawned a few beefs, right? Because off of the Demi Lovato, Wale, and honestly, Demi Lovato deleted her Twitter, I think. She deleted some. Yeah. Um, because she, people started making like, people posted, posted that, that boondock scene when she said her shit. So, yo, what the <laughs> fuck is you talking about? Shut the fuck up. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, they posted that, but then she deleted her shit. Then Chris Brown posted 21 Savage, um, the Quill shit, or one the, when he was rapping. Like, pull up with the fofo, when the fofo, he posted that yeah. shit, right? Yeah. And uh, he said, yo, stop playing with the mans them, right? The man them. He said, he said mans. 
said nah, yeah, it's not mandem. Yeah, it's, it's not mandem. It's not mans. Get it right. He said man. We know this mandem. He said mans. The mandem. Man, it's a mandem. Man, it's shout, it's, out it's, it's, shout out to my boy Karma Ov. Shout out to the mandem. Shout out him. The British say mans. So then, Offset said, "Yo, yo, it's not funny. It's not funny, lame." And then Chris Brown went off. And then everybody in the <laughs> comment section was like, I thought Chris Brown was defending 21 Savage. went off Jericho style, boy. But the thing is, people say tw- tw- uh, Chris Brown was defending 21. I think he was kind of like, he was kind of being funny as well. By I saying, think he was like, yeah. Funny, yeah, he was being, is- exactly. Where, tw- also was like, yo, it's not funny, lame. And people was like, yo, he was defending him. I was like, mm. He was being funny. He wasn't. Def- he wasn't defending. He wasn't, he wasn't defending. Funny. I feel no, like Offset and them are coming really. from. No, it's like anybody who's been in jail. Yeah, that's where they're coming from. Anybody who's been in jail is coming from the fact that right now he actually doesn't have yeah. his freedom. He's being made to do chores. So yeah. they're looking at people like Offset. Wait, is he he actually in jail, jail though? I know he. Yeah. He just got released jail. today. Oh, yeah, yesterday. Jail. Not jail. Jail. He got released today. Yesterday. Like, he was detained. Yeah, he, was, yeah. He, he had no freedom. He they, they he was they was making him do chores in there. Oh, so I thought they just fucking deported him. Nah, nah, he was arrested. He was confined. Just, yeah, he was detained. Arrested. So they hey, just released him today. That's why some people are saying it's not funny because that's his freedom. Yeah. But the memes are hilarious. The, the, the same, the same, the same, the same way, the same way that Chris Brown told that nigga Offset like, "Hey, bro, you you just want to fight?" That's how I feel with a lot of these niggas on Twitter, bro. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. Straight who? up. What you mean? Bro, Brago, stop. What do you mean? I, I, no. What are you trying to say? I was like, <laughs> stop, Brago. Wait, what? did you no. not hear him? What, what do you I, mean? What, bro, I mean, I'm, I, I literally mean like how that nigga Offset was just like, uh, you know, he was talking out the side of his neck. And the nigga was just it, like, pull up and sent him back. Wait, 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 wait. So you think Offset was scared of Chris Brown? No, I well, I think that he was scared in the sense that okay, so look, Brago, it's like like look, scared, it's very, it's very very because he like, can't do that. No, you can. do No, it, he though. can't. This nigga's on parole. What? So who gonna you, know? So what? Yeah, who gonna know? know? That nigga bro, said, Brago, here we go, Brago. Brago. <laughs> if I tell Brago, look, listen, listen, listen. If I'm on parole mm-hmm. and I say some fly shit to you on Twitter, mm-hmm. right? And then I just happen to be in in Baltimore or mm-hmm. whatever. And then you like, nigga, you like, like you on my side, bro. Like, nigga, if you got some shit on your chest, bro, like pull up, you know. Um, right. Or shit. If we at Anime, wait. If we at Anime Expo, and then you like, ah, oh, Matt, like, nigga, that's how you feel, bro. Well, let's fight. Let's box, Matt. Pull up. It's a few things, right? One. Come on, one, bro. One, this nigga bro. probably nah, be playing fuck. devil's advocate. No, nah, I'm about to drop some facts on you. One, he's on parole, right? Chris Brown just tweeted. So what? No, no, what I'm saying, Chris Brown, Chris Brown just tweeted what would, what would happen, right? Everybody would know that they fought, including his parole officer. That's one, right? Two. No, they wouldn't. Come on, bro. What do you mean they wouldn't? <laughs> come on, bro. They wouldn't. All right. If t- two people like Chris Brown, no, trust me, we had this conversation nigga. last time. <laughs> Cops can't figure out anything. <laughs> look, 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 no, 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 no. It is bro, so simple. I, you, know, so you know, you know how I know right? this is true, if, Matt. If Matt, Brown, they just did a wellness check on Chris Brown because he tweeted his address. <laughs> they just did that shit. So, Listen, if Chris, it, bro. What I'm saying is uh, two, right? I'm not pulling up to your house because technically, if you fucking shoot me at your house. Then what? Yeah. I'm invading. Okay, okay, nigga. Like, look, we can meet up at a central location. All I'm saying That's is, what I'm right, saying. That's if, fine. If everybody, That's fine. If everybody knows. I'm not pulling up to your house. Knows, if everybody knows that a nigga is on parole, bro, then, like, it's very simple, bro. If niggas, like, like see, this is what I'm saying, bro. Where, where we be at, if niggas is trying to fight, bro, let's just meet the fuck up. Let's go there. Wait. Y'all ain't got to put no shit on Twitter. Nobody record that shit. That's what I'm shit. saying. Just let... Chris Brown exposed and it. And then y'all niggas go on about y'all Chris business. Brown exposed it. No, nigga. He just put it on Instagram. Like, it, bro, he uh, responded to a comment. He bro, has he 50 million followers. He responded to a comment. <laughs> he to a comment. <laughs> That's he responded, I mean, I feel you like, okay, in that sense, yes, he did expose it. But it's the same the same way that that nigga was using Instagram is the same way that... Like, but Offset, bro, like you know Offset ain't about... Shit. Offset, the thing is, I don't what? think Chris Brown... I don't really think he bought that action. I think he's oh, I don't think Chris Brown I don't think so. Bro, Chris Yo, who Brown, has he fought? Chris Brown is Soulja Boy, how he bro, part of that action? Bro, he, bro, he backed out of the Soldier Boy fight. He wanted with Young Draco. No, he didn't. 
<laughs> bro, he didn't back out from no soldier boy. Bro, like, stop, bro. bro. Drake up said he got the papers. He still got the papers. Chris Brown is like six five doing karate. Chris Brown is yeah, not so six five. five. That nigga Chris he's Brown, six bro. Flat. That nigga Chris Brown is six four. No, he's, he's not. Four. He's six. Yes, flat. he is. He's six, he's six foot. Four. He's six four. No, he's not. Man. No, he's six, six foot. He's six four. He is he's not six four. Like, he can fight. My he's bro. not he six, six four. Six four. He's six four. Yo, Matt. Oh, he is. Chris Brown six is six not foot. six four. He's six foot, maybe five eleven. Bro, hi. Right, you pulled nah, nah, up on him or something? How you know that nigga ain't six four? That nigga is not six. That nigga is not six eleven. That nigga is six four. That nigga up. He's six four. He is not six four. He's six one. He's six one. I looked it up. Is he six one? I saw the nigga standing next to Chris Paul. Chris Paul had him. <laughs> like, <laughs> relax. Okay, okay. So Chris, okay. Look, it, it says that he's six one. <laughs> six Brago, four. That's about that's about as tall. That's about as tall as you. Okay. Uh, Brago, I'd like to think that you about that shit. But I don't, think, I don't think height. I don't you think still. I don't think still. Hey, Brago, but wait, but wait. I don't wait, think wait, height wait, has Brago, anything to do Brago, with it, though. Brago, you still a hoto, but oh how tall is never? That's what, and I don't uh, know how tall is y'all. Here's the thing, bro, bro, all of these niggas, all of these niggas in the anime community is short. But bro, I don't think height has anything to do with it, though. No, it, it no, it, it, it. no, it doesn't have nothing to do with it. It's just like, like, look, Chris so Brown is an athlete. He's an athlete. Okay. Yes, he's athletic. Offset, yeah, you can dance offset smokes. Chris Brown smokes drinks. too. Chris Brown no, drinks no, too. No, no, no. I feel like I, offset kind of lame, bro. Offset, yeah. Like kind of what? Offset is lame. Yeah, he's lame. Yeah, no, why I'm is he lame? What's the shit, terminology bro? right now? Yeah, why is he lame? What the? Bro, did fuck you see is how he was arguing? Like, the <laughs> I mean, he was. I mean, okay, that reminds me of a man that cheated. And he's just trying to get his girl back. That's it. yeah. I was, no, I was, like I feel like that nigga was trying. He was well, trying hard as hell just to. But that's the thing that when you, if you do some shit, you do it whatever it takes to get your girl. But that nigga was like photo bombing everything. Hey man, he's supportive husband. Nah, that nigga's wild. But but no, well, I said it about Offset. When I went to the, the Amigo show, Offset was the best performer they had. Yeah, because that nigga's the Offset best dancer. The, uh, Offset's the youngest one. Right? A, uh, he's like well, twenty five. No, he's like twenty five. Takeoff is. I think Takeoff is the youngest. Yeah, but they, like, they're all like young as shit. Like when you look at it. But the thing is, I, Offset can dance too. No, yeah, Offset can dance. Bro, Chris Brown can dance though. There's a difference between being able Offset to dance. Can dance but because too, he can bro. dance, that means he can fight. No, bro. No, it's that's what Matt's that, saying. Like, Matt's saying no, that shit. No, nigga. No, I, said, I said he's he's an athlete, bro. He's more. My athletic. thing is like, like who has bro, Chris Brown fought? That, other than Matt Rihanna. Draco. I mean, Drake, no, <laughs> nobody that nobody that Drake. we know of other than he fight Drake. Other Drake, than throwing, Wait, other Drake than throwing Drake. Drake, 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 Drake Drake. Him and Drake can fight. He threw a bottle at Drake. Oh, Drake. Well, Drake's bottle connected, but some like that. Some like that. Somebody threw a bottle. That's what I'm saying. Who has Chris Brown fought? Nobody niggas in on a block. Matt's making the assumption off like nothing. No, I, I would what I'm saying is Chris Brown. Brown okay, here's the thing. I think Chris Brown would more than likely do something stupid and go to jail forever. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on, hold on, Ali. You said I'm making the assumption off of nothing. It's a baseless assumption. No, you just it's, no. It's not a baseless assumption, bro. The nigga is he's crazy. The nigga, no, I think he's the nigga crazy. Is more I don't active. No, the nigga. I don't give a fuck about him being crazy. I think bro. that's the only the thing he has going crazy. for him. A nigga can be as crazy as he wants. The nigga is nigga active, boy. bro. The nigga, like, bro, the nigga, uh, he's an athlete. He, okay, wait, wait, it's wait. easier for him, uh, bro. He's trying it, to say he has athlete's foot. <laughs> Yo, it's easier. Fuck? It <laughs> like, so like, bro. White. I'm a, I'm gonna just be real, bro. If you're talk, if you're talking about like, um, a nigga, a, like, I don't think Offset can fight. I, I don't think I don't think a lot yeah, of rappers I don't think, I don't think, I don't think a lot of rappers can fight. I think Chris Brown can fight. I don't think I don't think a lot of rappers can fight. And yeah, then the I, way the energy that Chris Brown had, bro, this nigga literally told this nigga, bro, I'm a beat your ass. Up. I will whoop your ass, bro. And then this nigga told that he referenced yeah, so he referenced Neverworld. this nigga. No, 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 no. <laughs> no, no. For Neverworld, for Neverworld said, for Neverworld did not say, um, Hey, bro, when I see you at Anime Expo, I'm going to beat your ass. I mean, he kind of did. He said, he said he, say no, it to my no, face. He did not. No, he did not. Face, this bro. nigga said, that, look, look, look. Oh, my mama. You can tell <laughs> You can tell when a nigga is really about some shit and when he's not. For Neverworld, it's not about shit. 
Like, let's just get that I shit out like, the way. Yeah, I, I don't Matt, 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 Brago, Brago, you about to get niggas say that shit to his face. Expo. You I right. getting it. This nigga bro, gonna say this. I'm not, I'm not doing this. This nigga gonna say after you, after, after I beat I'm your not, ass, I'm gonna I'm put your I'm ass on a track, this. nigga. I'm not. Fuck I'm not doing none mean. of this shit, bro. Brago, you <laughs> fight Dustin, nigga. Stop. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah. Y'all niggas quit playing with me. Y'all niggas quit playing with me. Quit playing, Matthew. Quit, playing Quit, playing Matthew. Quit playing with me. Matthew. Quit playing with me. Quit playing with me. Quit playing with me. Quit playing with me. What did I play with me? What is Matt talking about? Quit playing with me. What is Matt talking about? Quit playing with me. Yo, Matt, we can't even say my Quit playing with me. Quit playing. Yo, this nigga for never got mad sick as fuck. Quit playing with me. Look, all I'm saying. She about to hit him with that dude. For never world don't count, bro. Like, like I'm, I'm like, like, bro. What about Chibi? I know. I said, I said this. Like, I said this on Twitter, now. bro. I said this shit on Twitter. When y'all going for never world, see each other, bro. You know what it's gonna be like. Them niggas gonna see each other in person, and it ain't gonna be like, oh, what you trying to do? What you trying to do? It's gonna be like nigga the standoff between Shanks and Blackbeard. Uh, well, that that was kind of hostile. Stop, Brago! Shut up! Wait, shut up! Bro. No, Shanks, no, Sha- no because <laughs> Shanks is about that action. We can't say that, bro. We can't say that. Shanks was ready, bro. Yeah, that, was, that was a bad analogy. <laughs> no, it wasn't a bad analogy, bro. It wasn't. Was them analogy. niggas, look, look, look. Them niggas, literally. Them niggas, literally. Nah, Shanks was like, bust a move, nigga. Pull up. Okay, Shanks said. Oh, so bust Shanks a move. is. Uh, Why did Shanks bust? Oh, so move? Shanks is for never. No, Shanks is not. You should have made it. Bro, y'all, y'all niggas all right, man. Me, bro. All right, okay. If, all right, if you had your, mo- if, if you guys could bet money, who you got your money on? Offset or I Chris? Got money, never. I got money off of never, bro. I'm talking about Offset oh, and Chris. Offset and Chris. Chris. I'm talking about Offset and Chris. Like that's for never. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'll say that Chris, nigga, I would bet, I, I would bet my life savings on Chris Brown. No, I, yeah. I don't know about my life Just like Riley put his life savings would, on I, Conor McGregor, I yo. Think if, I, if it was a fair, a fair win between Offset and Chris Brown, I think Chris Brown would get it, bro. I don't think Offset oh, can fight. I don't know, yeah, man. I don't think Offset can fight either. I think they jumped them niggas. Like, Offset, like the Migos be jumping I think Offset, I think Offset. Wait, 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 wait. What about this? What about this? Chris Brown, Chris Brown. I think if anybody, like, Joe Bobo might do it. What about Chris Brown and Trey Songz? I'm gonna give it to Chris. Chris. Trey Song. Here's the thing. I, I think I stopped liking Trey Songs. I think Trey bit. Songs is kind of ignorant, though. He'll no, Trey Songs, he's bit. it's like multiple cases of him jumping into the crowd and fighting people. That ha- that's happened. Yeah, a lot. I think he's a little ignorant. That's happened I, a I, lot. You know, funny that actually has happened a lot. It's happened a lot. But the thing is, why I kind of stopped liking Trey Songs. I don't know if you guys saw the Breakfast Club interview, his most recent one, where he's like going at DJ Envy. Mm mm. I didn't see that. That shit was kind of like he was acting like a bitch. It was just like wait, he was going at DJ Envy. Yeah, like he Envy not even gangster though. I, yeah, I hate when was, it was just like no, no, no. Envy, Envy be so trying to act like he gangster. Um, not really. Sometimes. He just he's just sensitive. Like, like I never get the impression that Envy is like, yo, I'm gonna fuck you up when I see. He's always like, yeah. <laughs> <It's>, <laughs> no, that is definitely not Envy. Yeah. <laughs> no. Okay. Okay. Like, remember look, the DJ look, look, drama? Not, the DJ it's, drama it's, interview. It's, he like he wasn't saying anything the whole interview. Then DJ Drama's like, "Yo, you good?" He's like, "Nah, man, we just had problems back in the day, and I just wanted to tell you, like, bro, why didn't you say that from the beginning?" And then the, the Desus and Mero interview when he got up and left, Envy ain't no yeah, son. like that's not the yeah, Envy not about that life. Nah, but Trey Songz was like, Trey Songz was saying, "Yo, how's your wife?" I know I got mm-hmm. a number. All the, I was like, he, "What?" He's like, "DJ Envy, this is why I don't like you, dog. Like, you just be saying dumb shit. Like, it was what? Like, yeah. What the fuck are you here? It I, it was just weird. Envy, it was weird, and Envy wasn't really going back. And I'm like, did does Envy know Envy something? Envy? I don't know. I mean, it was just like a weird. He's the, uh, he's the host of the show. What do you want him to do, Brago? What do you mean? No, he goes at everybody no, else, no. bro. Anybody like he he went at DJ Drama. He went at Decent Mary. He went at Killer Mike. So okay, so if I go up to you and I'm like, yo, I got your uh, wife's number, Brago. What you gonna do about it? You gonna be like, no, no you don't, bro. That's why he said he don't want Rory on the Breakfast Club. That's why he was mad at Decent and Mary because they made a joke about his wife. So with Trey Songs like kind of insinuating shit, it was just like yeah, but Trey, so, I don't think he knew that Trey Songs was gonna come at him like that sideways, or else he wouldn't invite him to the show. No, I'm talking yeah, about correct. I'm talking about I'm just saying like once he did, once he did, they were still cool. Oh, oh, he was yeah, still yeah. like playing with him, and then Trey Songs was like watch the interview, watch the Trey Songs and the most recent one, 
The most okay. recent one he was on the breakfast class. It was kind of wild to me. It was like how Trey Songz was disrespectful. Yeah, but, to DJ but especially like when it comes to wife territory, bro. Yeah, you gotta relax. Yeah, where it's like he was like, nah, 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 I'm just, I'm just playing. But it was just like, mm. nah, we ain't, I ain't playing no more, cuz. Yeah, because he was like, how's your wife? I'm like, yeah, I don't like she that. good. That's why. That's why. That's why Pusher was I mad. With, I would have hit him with that. How's your hand? That's why Pusher was even mad at Drake because Pusher said like, yo, don't even mention my wife because then you just you kind of insinuating that yo, you may have had dealings with her. Just by mentioning her, so off of that, I was like, mm, I don't know about Trey Songz, but uh, I think I think with Chris Brown and Offset, I don't know, I already don't know, I already don't know. But I'm, uh, I'm the way Offset was looking at Joe Budden at that one interview. What was that at the BET Awards? BET Awards, yeah. Look at how many people he was with. You don't get no fucking points. For how many me. people was he with? Yeah, it, it was like he was with all his niggas. Whole, had a bunch of niggas had a bunch yeah, yeah, yeah. If you see the, there's, uh, no, see, there's like no complex people though. Nah, no, they, they said one of the one of the things Joe talks about was that complex had no security. He said the security yeah. wasn't even there. Then, okay, so you got the three Migos, and then it yeah, was yeah, like P, two niggas P was there. Up, it was like, oh, what's up? Yeah, they had, well, they had a bunch of niggas like there. Nigga from the side Bro, you don't get way. you don't get no fucking points for acting like you about that shit. Well, you got a whole up, entourage with you, bro. Like what? Like I said, I like I like Offset after seeing him perform, but I um, but Chris Brown. Yeah, I, I like Offset, but I don't think he gonna beat up Chris Brown. I don't know. I just don't see how y'all think like Chris Brown. Like nothing that Chris Brown shows me shows like realize. realize I don't think realize, I don't think Chris Brown. I think, yeah, bro, I think real, Chris, bro, 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 Ali. It's just real, recognize real, bro. Like, look, the way that Chris <laughs> Brown told this nigga. Hey, nigga, like, bro, we could just square up. We could just Chris fight. Brown's been trying to talk like no, shit, though. No, 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 I nigga. No, listen. Talk, look, look, look. Bro, Chris Brown was always trying to press that issue with Drake. Drake never wanted that issue. Ever. But Drake a bitch. It, 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 exactly, relax. we know that relax. Drake got his son revealed. Relax, that sir. So obviously, Drake Chill, is whoa, whoa, else. like that's oh, not whoa, a good whoa, example. Whoa, whoa. Drake was not hiding the girl from his son. He was <laughs> from the girl. <laughs> bro, all I'm all I'm saying, bro, is that whenever whenever so that issue whenever that issue really comes to Chris Brown, bro, Chris Soulja Brown Boy. don't shy Soulja away Boy. from that. Why Nigga, Boy. He was Soulja ready Boy. to box. Soldier Boy pulled out the fight. Chris Brown didn't. Chris Brown. Well, Soldier Boy said Chris, Chris Brown. Just says he got his name on the fucking paper, and he said that you can ask Chris Brown about that. Soldier Boy could be lying. <laughs> so a, what are we talking about, man? Soldier Boy could be lying. He could be lying. Soldier Boy's a fucking liar. Like nigga, stop. <laughs> Soldier Boy's such a and liar. And then, and then, nigga, oh, and then, nigga, an uh, organized bro, an uh, organized. Like all I'm saying is, bro, what the fuck would Chris Brown have to prove? And fighting this dumbass nigga Soldier Boy, bro. That nigga Soldier Boy I mean, is literally fight like a hundred. Nothing, bro. Soldier Boy all. is like hundred forty pounds soaking wet. We got, bro, we got, I'm, we I'm got that. Who y'all got? Who y'all got? Game of Fifty Cent. Game. 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 Game is gonna rock that nigga. I got fifty. <laughs> game, bro. Game, you know, if fifty cent can survive nine game, shots, man, he can survive. I got I fifty, aka bro. Ferrari. Uh, now you're now you're wild, nigga. You thinking because a nigga can survive gunshots that that nigga can? Nah, not just that. Not just that. Not just that. Not just that. Why y'all say game? 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 I take. Because what game mean? literally was holding his oh, phone, oh, he and he whipped the nigga's oh. ass with one hand, bro. This nigga was, was running, huh? You talking, you talking about forty Glock? It don't matter. You talking about forty Glock? Yes, yeah. this nigga was running from the entire time. We talking bro, about that, Brago? Brago, I look, 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 bro, bro, I, Brago. I don't care. What? Wait, do you, wait, 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 wait. Bro. Do you think 50 Cent can do that? You don't think 50 Cent can do that? All right, this no. is what I wait, hold on, bro. No. Get the fuck you out mean, of here, man. Wait, 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 wait. You mean right now or like back in like when the whole At thing any was point. Happening? Any point. I got All right, a game. The thing is, is like back then, <laughs> I would maybe say 50, but right now, game, I feel like game is like still kind of like in their life. Yeah, and. <laughs> Fifty is like straight up corporate, like straight up. Nigga, corporate? I don't think game. I don't think game ever left that life. Yeah. Why do you say that? Yeah, Fifty Cent. Fifty Cent is more corporate. Did you see the bro, way he? Look up? at this nigga, bro. Game, bro. 
What? What about acts him? like a nigga? Game? What has he done? Game acts like a nigga, bro. That's listen, me, game, he ain't evolved game yet. Moves, bro, game moves. Game moves around like a nigga with nothing to lose. Yeah, yeah. I mean, uh, he's like, he that's definitely doesn't stupid. move around like that. How does that's he move around like that? stupid because he has a lot more. Wait, to how does he move around people? like that? Bro, that nigga recorded his beat. He, that was he like recorded ten years ago. Song. No, he recorded his oh, beef song Prado. with Meek Mill and Meek Mill's hood. Every time we see game, he's like with some fucking gangster ass fucking like blood shot or something or like fucking doing some shit. And 50 Cent, whenever we see him, he's like fucking. Yeah, he has a security. I'm a fucking, he's an yeah. actor. Oh, he's oh, yeah, he's, oh, he has security niggas with him. It's not a lot of rappers that I feel like is about that life, but game is, I think that nigga's authentic. What do you think, 50 is? It? I think, I think the most, I think the most. Yeah, people that think 50 are, is like, authentic? Like the most authentic. I don't think he's as authentic as the game is. What? I, I don't, don't. I don't agree. I think. I think like them hot niggas are just like like them niggas is different. New York niggas are different. Like, know, New York niggas are different. Nah. Yes. Uh, New York niggas, like, niggas is not like, different. No, no, no. New York game, niggas he looks like the dude that's gotten in a ton of fights in his New life. New York niggas are different. Like, you, wait, you don't think 50, you don't think fifty cent the type of nigga that been been in a lot of fights? Uh, nah. In his life? I think that that nigga has been in a lot of fights, but I think that that nigga has talked himself out of a lot of fights. Get the fuck out of here, game, uh, bro. Nah. You think fifty cent the type of nigga to talk himself out of a fight? Yeah. I think so. What do you yeah. mean? What does that mean? What does that mean exactly? I do. <laughs> what the um, fuck are we talking about? What do you mean? About? What does that mean? What does that mean? You think you'll be like, nah, dog, we ain't got to fight right here? I like how we're power um, scaling rappers. This is what I know. <laughs> this is what we power scale. That's what we do. I'm not, bro. Bro, listen, listen. This is, look, this is what I'm saying. Whenever, you remember whenever Gucci put out that tweet, Gucci was like, hey, any nigga that want to, uh, any nigga that want to box, bro. Um, I I whoop any rapper in the game. Well, that's, Kodak is that a lot of look, look, look. Gucci Kodak Gucci, ain't fight Gucci nobody. Said, Come Gucci on, said, man. Gucci said, any rapper in the game, I'll fight him. Nobody responded to that hoe. <laughs> Gucci be game nobody. game responded to that hoe. He quoted the tweet and said, "Nigga, what's up? <laughs> on it that you can't whoop me." Gucci didn't respond. Okay, All right, who wait, wanted wait, in the you fight? Think Why you not here or Corey? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I got Corey. I got Corey. Yeah, I gotta get my guy I got Corey. Corey. You know what I mean? he, yeah, I gotta uh, give it to Corey too. Hey, bro, I'm gonna beat your bitch ass. <laughs> <laughs> what like, about, no, 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 no. What about no? Corey or Slim Jimmy? Who the fuck is Slim Jimmy? <laughs> From Ray Shaman? Ray Shaman. The other, the other half. Come on, yo. Okay, Corey or Sway Lee. Oh, Sway Lee. Corey. Stop disrespecting <laughs> my man, Corey. Wait, wait, wait. Before we move away from the... We already moved away from the Grammy stuff, but did you guys see the Ariana tweets after this shit? Uh, no. Yeah, she, she's Bro, funny. Fuck that bitch. She was Ariana mad. Grande is the most Ariana Grande, Grande. No, she was mad. She was I, mad I, that I, Matt win. Yeah, she's mad. Fuck that bitch. And then also, Nicki Minaj got... She got attacked by fuck BET. So fuck BET, high key. Um, where BET, oh. after Cardi B won... BT came out and they said um Cardi B is like I'm kind of summarizing. Um Cardi B is winning Grammys while Nicki Minaj is out here being dragged by her lace front. Oh, oh wow, why being dragged by the lace front yes. though? That's uh, why BT hey. doing it? Right. And then Nicki Has Minaj Nicki ever won a Grammy? No, she's never won a no. Grammy. Um Nicki Minaj was supposed to perform Nicki Minaj was supposed to perform at the B at the BT Awards with Young Money. Apparently. Oh, she said, fuck that She shit. said, all right, the Young Money <laughs> experience is no longer going to be a part of the BT Awards. I'm going to let y'all know when the tour day is going to be back up. Peace. <laughs> Which was like, BT, what the fuck is wrong with y'all? The, I was like, mean? bro, BT is not Wendy's, my nigga. First of all, didn't they, didn't, they, didn't they do like an apology? After they, they, did, they, they did, they did, they did. But my thing is just that, all right, if we're just going to go by what BT stands for, right? Black entertainment. Yeah. You just shit on a black woman. For Cardi, who is Hispanic. I mean, isn't I she? Mean, she, kinda, she black. No, no, no. no, no. Rican. Cardi, she is Cardi is not. Cardi is not mixed. Oh, she's at all. she's not she's black at all. Puerto she's Rican. straight up. No, nigga, she's straight know up Hispanic. And regardless, oh, wow. and regardless, Cardi has um kind of marketed Fuck herself mixed. as a Hispanic chick. Ah, uh, we feel like she's black though. No, but she's not. <laughs> I mean, she's she been black. No, but what? No, but what? I'm, okay. <laughs> but what I'm saying is, for yeah, BT, no, that's that's like a, a smaller point. But it's just like, why would you put Nicki Minaj down because Cardi won? 
That has nothing yeah, to do with exactly. BET. Too. They was the I mean, I don't know. They were probably just trying to get some retweets. To it's stupid. <laughs> it's just stupid. Especially, if you, especially as a business, if you expect this artist to perform, what yeah, the fuck you think is going It's stupid. And honestly, I was embarrassed for BET. Embarrassed. <laughs> Wait, did the BET, BET hasn't happen? been good since like 2008, though. That's what, that's, but it's just like, why would you even do that? That's just Wait, so distasteful. Of, of course, it was like they, they're, they're blaming it on like an intern and saying it was somebody yeah. that's social media manager. All right, whatever. And then Nicki Minaj kind of tweeted a picture of the girl, and it got a little messy for a little bit. Um, oh. And Nicki even said that um, somebody said, "Yo, Nicki Minaj has been in the game so long. She, why she's been nominated like twenty times? Why hasn't she won a Grammy?" And Nicki Minaj came out and said, "Yo, I've been blackballed by this white man, and I'll, re- I'll reveal it all on Queen Radio." Oh. Didn't her just win <laughs> fucking album? Like, what the fuck you mean blackballed? Well, Nicki Minaj, no, Nicki Minaj, well, yeah. no, Nicki Minaj. She, I guess she said something to piss off, like. One of the curators of the Grammys or whatever. Yeah, she did. Um, it got, she got the big thing with him. Yeah, so I mean, that's it, it's kind of one of those things where, like, where I think, honestly, for I Nikki, like, why, I think people are kind of tired of Nikki. I think people just um, Nikki is bro. Nikki's the finever world of the rap game right now. Nah, yeah. can I say? Oh, look, I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just say this before y'all relax. go into that. Why do niggas? Or I, I don't understand why niggas need validation from the Grammys. It, I don't. It's the most prestigious award show. Sometimes yeah, I, don't, mean, I disagree with what bro. Saying, I don't. Bro. I don't understand. It's the most prestigious why show. Ni- I. That's like the Oscars and the Grammys. No, but, For music, but why do you need? Why do you need that validation? So that's one. Why, so that's one, why I'm saying it's, it's, it's why, a notch. It's a notch on your belt. Yeah, yeah because yeah. Um, and and so it's like the Oscars, did. right? They say Oscar winning actor. Or Grammy yeah, like winning, when they, when they, you also, and also, they, like, you can keep and also they said, the right? Yeah, and also they said, you, when if you win like, a Grammy, you're quite my bad. Okay, but we yo, can we can put as much power no, into compete, the BET you competing awards. with your peers too. Yeah, you yeah. competing with your peers we, on a different de- on a different degree. Yeah. We, we can put as much power into the BET awards. It's not as the same prestige. Do. Wait, wait. Yeah. Let me finish. That's we can hard. put as much power <laughs> into the BET here, Awards as we do the Grammys. No, if, nah, if, so. if, nigga, nigga, Says you're, too. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, you're, saying, like, you're nah, saying nah, nah you're saying <laughs> nah, but yes, you can. The Grammys never appealed to, they've never, like, like, they just See, now I'm started, they, they just started getting that shit right as far as, like, the nominees uh, it, but they still be getting it wrong with the awards. Yeah. Let me reference some shit real quick, bro. DMX fucking albums in what 1998 or 1999, and he didn't get nominated for any of them. And then both of them shits went platinum in that year. I'm sure you got a bill. Macklemore, sure Macklemore, Mac- and Macklemore won over Kendrick for Good Kid, Mad City. Yeah, that was bullshit. Which was bullshit. Their shot was kind of popular. And, nice. <laughs> and time, and time, and time, and time again, <laughs> there's been time and time and time again where the that they're okay. not for is black that, people. Is Matt lagging yeah, for Matt anyone? Lagging so, yeah, no. Okay, listen. We I can't understand let what you're trying to say, Matt, but at the same time, you can't just arbitrarily put power into the BET Awards when the Grammys are just way bigger than the BET Awards. Yeah, so, I, okay, my thing is the BET Awards, maybe black people need to make a, a, an award show that can rival what the Grammys are, but the Grammys is just like a long-standing history. It has the culture. Yeah, and it history. has just the prestige, right? And the thing is with Grammys, as they, they said, after you win a Grammy, your price goes up. Yeah, because you, you got, and that's you got and that's another thing. Like, even if we want to go down the whole route of like it hasn't been the the best to uh, like black artists, like it means that much more when they do win the Grammys and shit like that. Like the fact that Kanye has so many fucking Grammys, like yeah, yeah, you don't no, always get it right. It's also, it's also the thing with Kanye the is always is that validation from white men. So the the Grammys is shot. also uh, it's all music genres. Like it's like BT Awards is just gonna be black music. This yeah. with the pop and new rap artists. It's mainly and, so like hip hop and R and B, but the Grammys is and all music genres. And I'm not gonna lie, it's I feel like it's kind of different when you're recognized from somebody outside of your kind of peer group, right? As opposed to like like if somebody like the anime community is like, "Yo, video made us fire," 
as opposed yeah, to somebody like, in the film industry that's like, yo, your video is fire. I think I'm going to look at them like, damn. I'm going to give the worst comparison ever, but I'm going to do it anyways just because it's going to make people laugh. It's like the fucking it's like the fucking ghetto reverie with Virgo. It's like, why don't we hold that to the same standard as we hold the fucking regular <laughs> <laughs> reverie? It's like, we can't do that. Like, that, shit was yeah, better yeah. Than, that. That shit was better than the reverie that Joy Boy did. <laughs> Damn man. Don Bongo. Damn man. I hope I see you in the next reverie. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder why well, you ain't gonna be in well, the, the next Well ne- the next reverie is gonna be at uh Anime Expo. So and Roger gonna say you can't be there, bro. <laughs> Shit. All right. Fuck him. <laughs> <It's laughs> <reverie. laughs> Yeah, um, I don't know the whole BET thing. I was just disappointed in BET, man. Like you don't. Do, BET you don't used do. to be the shit, bro. They BET used to. stopped being BET... shit when Jay Z and Beyonce stopped going. The funniest tweet I B. said because everybody was like, "Yo, BET's canceled." It's like, "Yo, we're tired of watching Baby Boy anyway," which is fact because that's all they show. Baby Boy <laughs> and uh, uh, Tyler Perry, Tyler movies. Perry movies, the same fucking bullshit. So um, <laughs> BET's out of here if they weren't already. Uh, so that that was. They annoying. used to be the shit though. Used to one of six on Park Days. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. Uh, the next thing was like, which was a big thing, uh, and then I guess we have like a few more, then we can wrap it up. Was um, Liam Neeson? <laughs> oh, what happened? Did we not that? talk about this last time? Yeah, uh, I don't. We I didn't. don't want to. We didn't. Oh man. Um. So to set it up for the shit. audience, Liam Neeson, the actor from Taken, <laughs> Taken One, Taken Two, Taken Three, oh, Taken Four, Taken God. Five. Every movie that that nigga has done since Taken, it's been a Taken spinoff. Been been it's a Taken like, spinoff. Like, I've bro, seen like, Taken. Like on Into the, the Gray was the was Taken. Yeah, into, no, 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 yeah. Get back to the setting. Into yeah, the so. Into the Gray was Taken. Like if he <laughs> fucking the plane crashed. <laughs> <laughs> and then, yeah, you got <laughs> This is Taken, right? Yeah, you got to explain it for the audience. Anyways, Liam Neeson recently did an interview, or like a week or two ago. And he said that one of his friends was raped by a black man. And because of his, how angry he was Who's for, just for a smoke? week, <laughs> somebody, somebody, put, somebody pointed out, uh, somebody pointed out that somebody said that bitch lied. But one, first, one of the comments I saw under the interview, like on Twitter, somebody said that bitch lied. It wasn't no black man, right? <laughs> And I was like, That's, I don't know, that made me tweet out. When, when something goes wrong, <laughs> it was a black man. But Liam Neeson yeah. said for a week straight, he was out basically <clears throat> looking for a black I man did. to try him so that he could kill him. He said he wanted to kill a black bastard. So, <laughs> after I that... Mean, did we really bro. think he was for the culture that was Here's the thing, though. <laughs> <laughs> no, this like, thing is, yo. Really this thing was no, no, no. Somebody <laughs> said, I told this to somebody at work. This like, this nigga really thinks he's taken. <laughs> like, this nigga really <laughs> thinks he can, no, like, taken is a, it's not because it's a biography. This nigga that. really thinks taken is real. Like, he's. Nah, nigga, they so, said they adapted taken for that nigga. Right. Bro. But the thing is, for him to have that way of thinking, I think one of the best things I saw, one of the most accurate things I saw that I agreed with was like, He's pretty much George Zimmerman, but he didn't find his Trayvon, right? Where it's like he was just going off of attacking somebody because they were black and not finding. Why don't you find other rapists? Like why? Yeah, why is was, yeah, yeah, why is being yeah, black instead of saying like, oh yeah, I was looking for. Well, you can't really be like, yeah, that's a rapist. No, like, no, I know. What's appropriate is saying I was out there looking to see if I could find any man sexually assaulting another woman or doing something to another woman. So that I sounds kind of creepy though. It is creepy, but it's like you're yeah, just you're mad at the the action. It's easier to go black. You're Put mad at the action than the person <laughs> that's doing it. To put more context in though, there's two points that you gotta talk about because one this was like literally like i think it was like 30 or 40 years ago i don't know exactly how long ago but this was like a fucking this is a long, long time it's a while ago it's a while ago so that was for one and for two in the context of the story that he was saying i i agree it was fucking dumb for him to say it because it was like it's awkward dumb. and weird yeah. he should have said in the first place he but said the context of what he was saying was he was like trying to say how he like grew from this moment and he yes. realized how fucked up the thought was in the first place to have right so i don't think there's yeah. no 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 here's the thing in that sense i agree I agree. I agree with that right but i feel like um, what happened and what it morphed into was people was defending it, people was defending it, the action, right? Not even the the message he was trying to send. People were saying, well, he didn't do it, so what's the problem? 
That's what people like. Right. And it was just Sorry, like, taking away his message. I, I, he didn't do anything, but bro, what if he did find somebody, dog? Like, even mm-hmm. just that way of thinking is just so dangerous because that happens day after day to black don't people. Don't we do that to white people, though? No. No, we don't. We do. Wait, we do. We're, 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 tell, no. me, tell me, tell me, tell me. You like I want a white nick, like a white motherfucker to act up when like you see like shit on social media. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, we do those generalizations, generalizations like that. That's why it's good for him to like kind of well, well, have well, well, a. It's just a, it's, 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 it seems more and, demonized because he's talking about black people. We do yeah, like the, the thing is, people. is like. And well, another well, thing is, no, like, obviously, no, this, no, is, because, this doesn't really make it that much better. But like, it's not like he was saying he was just gonna the next black person he saw he was gonna yeah. kill. He was kind of saying like, you know, if I some will, dude tries to fight me, I, I just want someone to give me a reason to beat their. No, ass he was hoping it was a black person though. Black, though yeah, I know, I know, I know. So I mean, you don't you hope yeah, like, like we a do that to white people? I'm not saying this right on either side, but we do that to white people. So here's the thing: say, say. I, the thing is, I've never said I hope a white person approaches me after. Okay, but put it this oh, way: even no, though this is a little part. bit more yeah, loaded and part. and this is a little bit more reasonable, but say something like some fucking dude says something to you online that's like racist or whatever, right? And like that fucking triggers the fuck out of you. So like the next thing you're like, oh man, I wait for the next white person to say something racist to me. I'll beat the fuck out. You know, what? Yeah, something that's like that. You know what I mean? Like I don't but know. That, I, don't, I, feel, I think, I think it's the same. That, yeah, thing, yeah. It's kind of different because then that's directly tied to racism. This is rape, right? Well, well, and also when you see that too, it's like you can use example of like uh, this is a society with the cops. Like you see some, you see a cop do some shit to somebody. You just like, like you, foil you, period. At that point, you, it's you just like, any fuck cop, police all any together. cop, any cop, any cop. You, yo, you're, you're, you know, you're more you're mad like, at why you, you're why more you mad at black cops. Me, bro? Yeah. yeah, yeah, like, yeah. and like, you could be in the wrong. You'd be like, "Why the fuck you pulled me yeah, over?" Yeah, what's bro? up? You, you, you ain't my nigga. What's <laughs> up? <laughs> so that's what I'm yeah, saying. So I just felt like it was just dangerous. I mean, the thing is, I'm not killing Liam Neeson because this was fucking, it was so long ago. I think it was stupid to say because there's some things that I've done that I would never say, right? Just because right, it's yeah. just today and yeah. how, how 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 society is today is like certain things that just wouldn't fly. That's like- I think like, I wouldn't even like explain this situation. No, like, I feel like, no. no. I'm talking about like yeah. even like what we're no, talking I'm about agree now. With you. I wouldn't even like explain, be like, oh, well, we do that to white people because I feel like- if I was like a big artist right now, like people are like, oh people shit, that nigga cooning. People will kill you. Like, oh, people, that nigga's cooning. Like, like, <laughs> like blah, blah, blah. if you put into another. And like, then now, now people are like, oh, that nigga Corey Duran is canceled yep. because that nigga. <laughs> like, literally, niggas do that. What do you? What like, do you, I've listened to my girlfriend talking about, oh, he's canceled. I was like, why is this nigga canceled? And then she'd be like, oh, I heard. Blah, blah. And then my mom, I'd be like, bro, mm. you heard or you just saw. That's a lot how of it is. This, so you you want to hear. No, the thing yeah. is, we're in a hashtag society where it's like, if I can post this this dope ass hashtag and say I'm with it, I'm with the shits, and I don't give a fuck who gets trampled over. And then, and then niggas take a sound bite of what you're saying, and then like yeah. so say for me explaining that niggas like, oh, well Corey said it's okay for Liam Neeson to say that about black people because we do that about, and it's like, no, that's yeah. not what I was explaining. Yeah. And then also yeah, nah. speaking of sound bites, I saw Young Orphe quoted Matt and said, "Yo, Matt, I saw you shouting me out on the on the stream." <laughs> I saw that yeah, went back to Young Orphan. No, first off, that stream was like weeks removed. Well, that was um, I think that was a 2018 smoke. recap, no? Yeah, yeah that, I'm saying that was it was so long ago. Yeah, yeah. Another thing that's kind of related to the, that shit, but not related all. Did y'all see that shit with the Gucci uh, sweater? Yeah, yeah. Uh, the black face. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I don't know if I'm that. Mad. I don't know if I'm really that mad at that. I don't, I don't know. know. Yeah, I don't think that's that whole thing. thing you know why? You know why I think a lot of us. When I say us, people that don't really wear Gucci, we're not mad because we're like, you don't know me. We're like, oh, true. You're Asian. But um, we don't, we, I didn't give a fuck because I don't wear Gucci anyway. I don't wear Gucci. So it's just like, hey, welcome to the club, my niggas. Like, oh, you wear Louis now? You grew up a little bit? I'm, I, I, no matter how rich I am, I would never wear Gucci, Louis Vuitton, Fendi, Mm -hmm. ever, Mm -hmm. ever. I agree. I agree. That shit yeah, like, is stupid. I just feel like you just you just buying shit that like, that doesn't Bro, even necessarily look stupid. good. I would never. Gonna, I would never buy. Anyway. I would never buy a seven hundred dollars. The worst thing I see is that niggas, Bro, on, niggas on, be rocking on, the same had, shit. Okay, so if you had like Floyd Mayweather type money, it don't no, matter, bro. I would never buy a seven hundred dollars t shirt. That's dumb. What are you gonna spend, spend your money on, I, nigga? I could spend seven hundred dollars on some good. You ass know what food. I could do, Ali? I could start my own fucking clothing brand. Oh, I mean, you can't. Yeah, let's see where no, it goes. And then invest in another black clothing brand. 
clothing brand. Bro, what's the di- like? Like, what makes that shirt seven hundred dollars? Because it's Gucci. That's it. Because I mean, black it's just people the brand. Wear it. yeah. didn't, wait, didn't they do this? They got some shit from um. Somebody did this. Somebody did an experiment. Um, they got some shit from Walmart or Payless. Payless, and they, they said put on it? they put. Uh, I think this was Kanye. This was like Kanye designed or some shit, right? And that shit sold for like seven hundred dollars. Shoes from Payless. Well, yeah, I mean, yeah, that's the thing. It well, is just, it's know, literally when, just even a brand. If you, like, 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 even like, if bro. you see a test, like I've seen, like a um, it's like literally the exact same shoe, the exact same color, the exact same pose, and they just put different logos on it. And then you see People how eat it up. like how programmed you are, and you like, damn, the Nike holes look kind of better than the Reebok holes, and you're literally looking at the same like, fucking shoe. I think like, that's like, the same. Bro, you know, you know them uh them Balenciaga shoes, bro. The ugly. Yeah, them holes ugly. Said, as fuck. If ugly. them shit said sketches, yeah, I don't fuck with those. If them shit said sketches, <laughs> niggas holes, would bro, be like, nah. Nobody would wear They're them. They're ugly as hell. But the thing is, they ugly I think as that fuck. goes. That goes to magnificent branding, branding by these companies, right? Where they've branded themselves so well. I don't even that... think it's them branding. It's niggas branding. Bro, no, it's but... niggas branding them. No, but they had to. They had to start somewhere, and they've yeah, got to the point. Got they've, but they've, no, they've got to. Branding, no, they've got to the point. Money, bro. Okay, okay. I don't look, think it's look, just look, money. I think it's this... the fact that like they marketed like the, the product, and now the product is worth a certain amount, and people are buying it. Up. No, I, I, I think, think all you gotta think... do. Oh, I'm sorry. Go ahead, all you gotta do. I, I was just, I was just gonna say, bro. I think rappers and black folks have taken that to another level because black people they buy them shits for a status symbol. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's they all it is. Shit, yeah. They they buy that shit to to make themselves feel validated. So whenever whenever you don't got no Gucci whenever a regular nigga whenever a regular nigga see whenever a regular nigga see a nigga in Balenciagas it's a it's a conversation starter and this is directly you know some shit that Wayno said on Everyday Struggle uh, if you see a nigga in some Yeezys it's yeah. a conversation starter you'd be like hey, hey damn you got shit Yeezys? set. Where, where you get them shits from, bro? Because they're exclusive. So it's not. It, it, it's not. It's not more yeah. so what what they what they are. It's right, more so of how you got represent. them. How yeah. you got them. What they represent, and and the fact that somebody that you can most people don't have them. That right. No, exactly. but why did That's you choose that brand? Because niggas don't have it. So you want to be like, no, hey, nigga, look what, what I got. I'm saying is these brands. Because they cost a lot. They, because it costs a lot. Why do they cost and a lot? The, bro, look, bro, all you got to do, like, do you think if it's you simple just to get to where pri- Gucci Just jack the price up on whatever your product is. It's not now. And it, it automatically becomes ex- exclusive not because only a limited oh. amount of people can buy if, it. If, if Gap works, works to jack this shit up, you think people are going to just start scrubbing down? You have to work to that. It's because of the material, but also why they're expensive. That's what I'm saying. goes back to the Yeah, let's not act like these $700 shirts are like the same as a dollar shirt from like fucking Good quality. They're not worth $700. It's not worth $700. They're not worth $700, but that's the whole thing about like... Uh, your uh, the brand, what, and let's like, not all. I guess you would say like all the designs, the are cloud that you have. They're not there's defini- there's there's some definitely, there's definitely like some, good some shit. yeah, there's some shit that's like okay, that's literally like okay, like Supreme for example. It's like it's just a fucking hoodie with like a Supreme logo on it or whatever, right? A, a but there's some it. there's some like cool Supreme hoodies and like different shit like Branding. that. Like, there's a lot of cool shit. Branding. Like, yeah, I think that goes back to just like marketing and like finding the hitting the market at the right time and having the the, the right people wearing it, right? Where rapids niggas with money, bro. Yeah, but niggas, it right, don't, you don't even have to have that's money, part bro. of marketing. As long as you're willing to spend a lot of money on the shit, that's part of marketing. Yeah, right. Like you're putting money marketing. Yeah, I'm gonna pay. I'm gonna pay Kanye to rock the Supreme ho- uh, hoodie. Yeah, but another thing is, is like I might be completely wrong about this, but wasn't Gucci still like pretty popular even before like the rappers and shit like yeah. got into that? Right? Yeah, yeah. That's why I like, got into it. The thing is, like Gucci Mane's name was Gucci Mane, and like that was like that, fucking, no. Like, the thing is, named... rappers latched on to things that were popular, like Matt right, was saying, exactly. for validation. They were already popular, exactly. but yeah, yeah. rappers. It's not even close. People... That's like in general with like everything. If Benz's, Benz's favorite athlete. Benz. If you see LeBron, want to get a Benz. LeBron. Yeah, you see, like, it's like with his it's shoes, more like you want to get some LeBron shoes. It's like the same thing with everything. You like kind of, you see, I don't know, you like you look up to something, this? or they it's like, like the Grammys and the BT Wars, bro. It's like okay, all these white folks is doing this, all these wealthy people are doing this. So now, as a black man or as a rapper or whatever, as a person of society, that people told me that or that they look down upon, I'm doing this shit now. So look at me. Wait, does everybody it's have a validation thing. item that they would want to get in the future? Um, no, no. Um, 
Nah. I don't know if it's a validation. I don't really care. Item, for, like, but there was, it, I would definitely buy like. If I, uh, maybe a, if you could, I'm getting, yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting a nice house. I'm getting, yeah, I, was I, was like, maybe a nice I don't house. care about the car. Like, I'm getting, I'm getting a nice ass house. Maybe a nice house. They call that shit nice ass house. Wraith, the thing that has like the car that has stars on the top of it. I don't care about cars, bro. I think give me that. Literally, I would get the bomb ass house. I was about to be a straight. I would, I would get like. I'm talking about my my. Nah, so but the thing is, I always said I build my car from scratch, but. I would, Shut yeah, that'd be my goal. That'd man. be that, you don't be that, driving a goddamn car. That would be my so. um. That would be my uh, <laughs> like my uh, my passion project. Like, Yo, project? A car, yeah, I bro, 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 this ain't fucking 1942. We don't build cars anymore. Bro, though. I, would build, I would build. I would build. I would build. I would. Why build. don't you build your house from scratch? That's stupid. Boy, fuck <laughs> out of here. <laughs> you can, bro. <laughs> what the, you mean? The likelihood. The likelihood. What Mark Wahlberg did? That nigga ain't gonna see that whole finished. The likelihood. Why would I build a house from scratch? Because then you can get it. What you can get every single piece that you wanted the house instead of like going spending. No, 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 no. Like I'm saying, building, building a house. First of all, first of all, I can't like build a house from scratch. You can still pick the shit from scratch without building it. You're gonna when you're talking about building a fucking car, you're talking about putting your hands on every. Yeah. yeah, I'm not doing that for yeah, a house. That's what he said. That's what, that's what, what I'm mean? saying. For a house, it's like the electrician, the plumber. Like, I'm not doing all that shit. Roofing, yeah, you're yep. crack foundation. Car, like, I'm know, not doing a, what? Are you, you serious? Are highly underestimating how hard it is to build a fucking car. No, it's probably hard, but it's, it's harder to build an entire house. I would say it's harder to build a fucking car than but Ali. Ali, that's nah, what I'm saying. No, no, no it's not. No, no it's not. Way, no way. Ali, what are you talking know, about? Like, doesn't like, you're going too far with that. I mean, to build a house, you. I don't even think you could do that by yourself. You can. Bro, it, there's too many. Okay. I no, think no, no. it's the too many things between, you have to do, bro. It's too no, no, no. many things, bro. Between, especially, especially with the house. No, no, no. If it's a validation <laughs> house, it's a huge fucking house. And then you gotta pick the spot where that whole. Yeah, thing. Man, like you, you build a house from scratch. Is like you like basically design this thing yourself. But I you just, get like designing a house labor. isn't building it though. No, but like actually getting the labor like work shit, like that's building your own house. No, it's, no, it's not. not. What that's the fuck? What, that's what everybody no, do. Ali, what I'm talking about with the passion project for the car. Everybody. Like everything for the, the car. Fuck, you know, building everything, houses. everything for the car, I will be touching and assembling. That's what you're talking about. Because, 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 I, because I, the I, thing I, is, I, the I, thing I, is, I, for, I, the, for the car, it's like, I know it's going to take forever. Why are we even talking? But I have <laughs> money, and it's something that I would like to do. It's no, not, fuck that shit. You're going to give up halfway and just leave that fucking shitty ass car in your garage. A car is not like a computer where you just put parts together, my G. I said it, it's exactly that. <laughs> Ali, no, Ali, 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 Ali. If you're making that shit yourself, no, it's not, dog. No, Ali, you, Ali, you, you order the parts. You order the engine, or whatever yes, the fuck you want, yes. and you put that shit together for the for the house. Yeah. It's a it's a, it's a tad. You don't order a dining room. It's a tad you know, bit more difficult, Ali. Yeah, <clears throat> let me order a basement right quick. Uh, the, you know, I, 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 I'll, I'll it's Ali, you think you think I'm be running the pipes? I'm be running the pipes. House, I think it's more like. I, I think it's more labor, but it's not. No, it's more. It's more than labor. Like, it's a lot more than labor, Ali. Uh, Ali, 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 I've been on several construction <laughs> sites, right? And yeah, me too. Me it's too. so many different people doing different things for one yeah. person to do all that shit, bro. Come on, dog. Yeah, that's why I said it's more labor. I didn't say it's like, but I'm talking about in terms of difficulty. I would say it's Nigga, that's it, hard, bro, bro. I don't even know what you have to do to make a house, to be honest. Like, <laughs> I'm just saying, so much right. First of all, <laughs> you gotta make sure the foundation is legit. You gotta make sure the land is legit. You gotta make sure that shit ain't gonna fucking sink. Of course, if the no, foundation I'm saying like I'm not saying building a house is fucking easy, but I'm saying like if this was like a mission in an anime, like building a fucking <laughs> car is like an S tier mission, building the house is like an A. Fuck out no. of here. Fuck out of here. No, no, no. The thing is, the type of house that we're talking about, we're talking about like a fucking wall, fucking mansion with an indoor swimming pool and a basketball. Indoor swimming pool? God damn. Yeah, I would like an indoor swimming pool. Yeah, but what kind of fucking job are you going to You're gonna become CFO of fucking McDonald's? Wait, I don't think you need to be fucking... Well... Yeah, bro, an indoor swimming pool. I've known some rich ass motherfuckers. I've never seen an indoor. Yeah, I'm having. I'm having. You know, have you, have you don't need. A, you don't need to be that high up. Like you can be a doctor and have a fucking indoor swimming pool. Like not saying a doctor isn't high up, yeah. but you don't have to be like the owner of something of a business or like like a CEO. Bro, I'm owning a business. I'm having my frozen yogurt shop. Shut up. For real, frozen yogurt shop. Yeah. What the fuck? I'm opening. 
Yeah, shit. Yeah. How much? How much do you like fucking frozen yogurt? I love that you frozen, make frozen yogurt. I do love frozen yogurt, but regardless, because I like frozen yogurt. Regardless, um, Matt fell into the matrix and never came back. Yeah, R.I.P. Nah, you know where he is. We are. We all know. Down the like. rabbit hole. Exactly. I'm gonna eat a big ass of cereal, bro. Y'all niggas bullshit. Nigga, I'm right here, bro. Y'all just <laughs> what? what we're, 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 just, we're, just, we're, just, we're just doing the podcast. That's it. Um, <laughs> wait. Uh, the last thing I want us to talk about was the um, I guess the, the Tory shit. Y'all want to talk about the Tory shit? Oh, oh shit. Uh, Tory Lanez is at it again, guys. Uh, Tory Lanez, you know who Tory issued a challenge to any rapper or anybody said, yo, I can out-rap anybody, challenge me, whatever. Mm-hmm. Apparently, a rapper called Dax, and he's also oh, from Tor- uh, Toronto. Dax, a rapper from Toronto, challenged Tory, and he put out a track about Tory. And Tory inboxed Dax and said, yo, don't, you don't want these problems. And somehow Tory ran up on Dax, and Tory got Dax to actually apologize to him. And Dax said, "Oh no!" no. Dax said, Yo, my I, I saw like an you. interview. I saw an interview with um, Dax and DJ Academics, and the way Dax was making it sound was like, "I didn't know what was gonna happen to me, so I took the smart route." And rather than like you know something bad happened to me, what's uh, I be I was I'm like the bigger man. Or he's like, I'm setting a new standard where it's okay to apologize. No, no, no. Uh, no, no, no. no I'm not saying that's me. I'm no, not saying those are his oh, words. that's me. Fuck that. I ain't getting shot. <laughs> that's not what happened. Fuck that. Y'all can take your pride to the grave, fucking dumbass. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. I agree. No, what I'm saying is he did pull a gun on me. I probably got a bitch out of Nevis like his cover. Yeah, no, no, no. I think he just should have said, like, Yo, I was shook, and I know what a man. Was. Well, he kind of did say that. I, but the yeah, thing is, don't he, don't he, say I'm trying to set the new standard. No, bro, you. No, he, did, he definitely said I'm saying. No, ain't bro. no new standard. You were shook, and you said sorry. That's yeah, it. that's what I'm saying. That's what I said. Fuck out of here. That's that nigga it. Escaped. You were shook. I mean, you said sorry. I can see what he's trying to say though, because it's like ain't no dude, new standard, remember, niggas that are shook. No, no, no. <laughs> bro, remember when we were talking to fucking Jordan, and we said, bro, someone's got a uh, what's called a gun to the back of your head. What do you do? And he's like, man, I ain't saying shit. I ain't saying sorry. Nothing. I'm going well, down Jordan, like, hey. well, the thing is, I don't know what Jordan is in his life. I don't know if Jordan has children. I don't know if Jordan cares about his family. Jordan was saying, yo, I'm 6'5". I'm going to challenge anybody with a gun. I'm like, my nigga, I don't exactly. care how tall you are. You still going to catch these bullets, fam. So for for him to say that, I don't know where he at, where he is yo, in relax, life man, for him doing, to dog? say that. <laughs> yo, yeah, what's going on? Yeah, you can oh, keep moaning in the fucking mic. <laughs> <laughs> my bad. I just, I just took a puff. Bad, You're getting way too puff. comfortable, my dude. Yeah. I took a, I took a it's puff like, of a blunt. Relax, on, dog. Yeah, took a puff relax. of a blunt. No, you trying to ignore some shit the first time? Yeah, it's like, like just keep going. Made a million dollars or something. Like what the fuck? This nigga, but anyway, um, yeah, I thought Dax was. I thought Tory was kind of just. I think that was kind of soft. Because, Yo, why didn't that nigga pull out a track like he said? Why yeah. did you run up on him? Why you run up on him like that? Because he's from Toronto and it's like he's not on the caliber of rapper you I mean, expect to challenge you. Is, like, intimate, bro. Like, yeah. He probably got like, niggas with him, but I would pop that nigga. I mean, what? I just don't think. I feel like nowadays, just beef in general on that level, it's just stupid. Nowadays, man. Like, bro, it's why are you trying to fight me because we rapping? <sighs> How old is Tori? Tori, like 28. But too old and too no. old to be doing the shit that he be doing. I don't think so. Tori ain't like young though. Tori ain't no young. Nigga. Yeah, he like 25, 26. Tori ain't no 26. Though. No, I don't, I don't know. Let me see. But another thing is, is what happened in the first place? Why did he get mad? I, I'm so confused. He like, put out a diss track. Put out a track. No, I know that, but why did Tori get mad at him? Like, I guess he's not Tory on saying... his level, so it's like, don't challenge me, young boy. Oh, he's 26. Uh, I guess. Yeah, I mean, apparently, like, I, but it's I like, the didn't like, Tori like kind of send out a young. thing like anyone can fuck with me type thing, or was that? My you, thing you know how people, said, you know how sometimes people say, "I ain't he's sensitive." The best rapper. They star. <laughs> they X, uh, uh, was his this good? Uh, I ain't uh, listened to it. Honestly. Yeah, I've been listening. I heard it was like, I heard it was all right. He's a YouTube rapper though, so like you can't expect too much, you ain't? I mean, wow. what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> YouTube rappers are trash. Oh. <laughs> oh, you want, you want me to spell it out for you? Don Don Who do you count as Durant, Durant is now, Trey. <laughs> Yo, who, who's snoring though? Quietly gone, huh? Quietly gone? Nah, the Don. Is that Matt? Oh, Matt, man, that Matt really took the guy that he wants to be a regular. 
Oh, no way. Come on, man. No way. All right, we're about to eject this nigga. Time to eject no. this No. Oh, my no God. Way. This dude just... No way. <laughs> he ain't sleep. He fucking around. He was just saying no, some shit. Not, bro. They have fake snores, my They have fake no. snores. This nigga's fucking around. Anyway. Um... Uh, oh, my nigga was we just talked about like did we talk about white players. White, <laughs> white we talk about he can puff about big. white people playing black uh, <laughs> or black characters sleep. playing white people. Did you guys did we we ended off with that? Where it's like I thought we talked about wait, that wait, shit. black characters doing what? Where it's like do you guys playing have a problem with like people. like uh, black Superman? Are you talking about like Will Smith playing? Oh, no, no, no. You know what's you know what's kind of crazy? I don't really got a problem with it, but I don't see the need for it. Like I don't need to see a black Thor. I don't need to see a black. I, mean, I don't know. You don't want to see a black guy. Yeah, they're, they're saying they're saying they're exploring Michael B. Jordan being the next Superman. Fuck out of here! But there was a black Superman in the comics, though. That might look actually pretty good. Okay, now, now this is what I see. What's wrong with that? When though? it comes down, when it comes down to comics, I need the, I need them to keep it like however it is in the comics. Like just imagine if, yeah, if like, I don't know. It's hard to say because Superman in the comics. Imagine if, like, because if, if you say you don't care, imagine if the Black Panther was a white guy. Like, you want to call him White like, Panther? On, I no, mean, no, is, he's still the Black Panther. Panther. But if, he, if he's still the Black Panther, he's the Prince of South Africa, and he's fucking I'm white. Pissed. Well, you're saying South. There's a lot of white South Africans. Yeah, there's a lot of yeah, a lot of white South Africans. But it's a little What's different because, like, like, black, I mean, we don't really white. have too many like superheroes. Like, we got we have like Black Panther, we have Luke Cage, we have Blade, we have uh, Mister Terrific. And then we have like static, and then like John. We got that. We got that I, I guy. Wait, 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 wait. I'm thinking, like I don't give a we fuck about like comic books myself, so I couldn't care. But like I'm thinking, like if they made like a One Piece movie and Zoro was black, I'd be like, ah, yeah, Zora? exactly. Like, like, <laughs> what, if, what if Daz Bones is white? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, yeah. I think I don't, I don't have a problem with it. I just feel like you just gotta, like as long as it's good scenarios, acting, that's all. I feel like in certain scenarios, like um, that. You can like substitute like a, a actor from a different race, but when it comes to like shit that like we've known, like mm. nah, I don't want to see that shit. Like we can we can see a black Spider Man because Miles Morales is an actual like black Spider Man. Yes, yeah, that like, makes sense. We can see shit like I that, don't... but like I don't want to see no white. See, wait, people shot. lost their mind. People lost their mind with the black uh Mary Jane that they had in the new like movies with Tom Holland. The fact and she that Mary killed Jane it. Was black. She was dope. People, people hate people hate. She that. was dope. that's Mary Jane. Yeah, that's the Mary Jane. Zendaya? Black oh, yeah, I thought Zendaya. she was something yeah. else. That kind of ruins it. Now. How does it ruin it? Because, man, like, I, it, I, I want it all the like, movies to go, uh, follow along with but the she's half story. Like, so she's okay. Bro, your, your race doesn't affect the storyline. Yeah. I mean, it's like just like when I what's called Death Note came out and they whitewashed the fuck out of that and they made like I didn't want fucking white people there. I, I mean, wanted them all to be Asians. <laughs> well, I don't think that's not because I'm like it's racist, but that's just how the story follows. I'm pretty sure in Hollywood they got castings and it's like I'm pretty sure I don't I, I don't I would never notice, but I would think that their roles like yeah we need a black man this height this they kind of that. voice to play this character like or yeah, but, yeah but, not, but guys I, I feel like I feel like we gotta we gotta kind of get out of the. The mindset of th this person should be white because that's what I've known. Because honestly, all I've known is white James Bonds, right? That's all we've known. Yeah, my nigga, oh, okay. my I nigga, I would, I would, I would like to see Idris Elba as James Bond. I would, you know, it's crazy. Uh, he ain't James Bond. I'm on the fence what? right there because I, I would, I want to too, but I can understand people. Nah, against he's double up. I do want to see. What I'm talking about right. is something going against a direct source. <laughs> <laughs> There's not it could be 008, 009, It don't matter. He's not 007, Brago. You, we can't. We don't. We can't see that. Why not? Why can't he be 007? <laughs> because the story, the way the story is written, is for a white dude. Huh. No, whoa, whoa, whoa. See, see, no, Tell no, me no. what they, does they what, that, what does James the Bond novel. do that the black man can't do? Yeah, it's not that a black no man race. can't do it. It's just <laughs> that's how the story falls through. Just like uh, tell me what says, I don't want a white guy. I don't want a white guy playing Black Panther. That shit's whack. That's different because it's called Black Panther and he's from fucking Wakanda. I don't care if this dude's name was White Panther and he was fucking black. I wouldn't want White Panther. <laughs> no, Ali, you know, Ali, I'm saying, how does Idris Elba change the storyline of... How do you Bond? feel about a white guy playing Shaq? That's, <laughs> but that's just stupid, though. Yeah, exactly. I like they got to keep it. Oh, no, Wait, a biopic? Ali, this is the you thing, You want a biopic? Bro, I, Ali, this is the thing, bro. <laughs> Come on, Ali. 007 is just an alias. It's a code name, bro. Anybody can be 007. But when you affiliate 007 with James Bond, like why can't why what's wrong with him being 008? 
Why can't y'all have double? <laughs> Wait, why can't he be double double oh seven? He's a higher number, so that means. Why can't he be double oh seven? You fucking okay, racist. This, this, here's the thing. Here's the thing. I think I think the thing is at the end of the day, like when we. I don't know. I feel like we kind of like focus in on the race part of it too much, but like at the end of the day, like we, we, I just like shit to be I, true. No, no, no. But, like, hold on, let me finish. But I think like there's other factors that like I think we could keep consistent. We would also not want to see it. So, for example, if James Bond was like a female, I don't think we would like that either. Because right. that, that changes Bond, the story. If James Bond was like some what fucking can, fat agent, I don't think do we would like that either. Chicago? Like the whole thing of James Bond is like he's this suave like fucking. He's British suave and fucking women. <laughs> Yeah, but like, so if we had like some fat Asian, we'd be like, "What the fuck is this?" <laughs> no, but if we had an Asian that's in shape and suave, you know, like, it doesn't matter. Know. Then we're gonna put this guy as double O, like triple O seven, like you know, someone else. Why does they have to? Why, bro? Double O seven is just a code name. Bro, if you want to make a black guy an agent, why not just make a new series? Why you got to follow 007? That's but no, that no, Bond. that's a part of it. But I don't think there's a problem with Idris Elba playing James Bond. <laughs> The dope ass nigga. What, what's the problem, bro? I just would like it to f the movie to follow the source material. That's the what's only the thing. source just material. Like, just like if if Tony Stark was like Asian. What's uh, the source Brazilian, material? The source material is James I mean, Bond's this white British dude. That's a well, badass. But I'm saying, than, and I'm saying, okay. So what's if the person comes out that wrote it and says, oh, now it's a black dude. Yeah, there's the no, person I, that I wrote it has, and changed no, no, it to a black guy, no I'll be 100% fine. I think he has no race in the book. James Bond from like 1940? Yeah, yeah I, don't, I don't think he has a race. Oh, bro, 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 what if what if the person that wrote it like says, like, yo, it's just a code name like, that's passed down from generation yeah. to generation? And now he's a agent. black guy that's like the best the best agent we have. No, so he inherited 007. Okay, okay, okay. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. You don't think he could? No, I said I think he could. I agree. I think he would kill it. I'll be fine if the writer did that. Don't call him James Bond, though. Why he not? No, he's he, he not James Bond. James Bond. But I'm saying, like, if they, I mean, but even if he was James Bond, if it's just an alias, what's the problem? What's the problem? Okay, if it's just an alias, I'm saying don't have whatever hit the origin. Bro, name we've had Pierce Brosnan. We've had what Daniel, uh, what's the fuck his name is? We had Sean Connery. They've all na named James Bond. What's the problem with Idris Elba also being named James Bond? You want me to just, as like, long as it doesn't, doesn't it be James up? Jackson? Because no, he's he black. Has. As long as it, the movie doesn't pick it up like Daniel Craig, like this is the new Daniel, like you know, it's following that story. As long as he gets his own story, I'm fine with it. But if he gets, like, if it's following whatever how Daniel did, Craig did, 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 did that's kind of trash. How did Daniel Craig, Greg, Craig, uh, pick up his storyline? Daniel Craig picked it up. What? What was the first one? Did he have his uh, own story? He has like what? He has like three of them. He has like Casino Royale. That's what I'm saying, who did he pick up from? I don't know. I didn't watch the ones before that. I'm saying he had his own story. Yeah, but you asking me. But what I'm saying is, why wouldn't Idris Elba have his own story? That's well. You're saying he's picking up James Bond's yeah. story, so I assumed he's going off that same thing. No, but if this is a new character, I said it's fine. I have no problem with a black man playing like a James Bond. Look. The thing is, I don't want the same story. Like you know how uh, you Andrew Garfield is Peter Parker, right? Okay. That's like if Peter Parker was black, that's kind of weird to me. But the way they did Miles Morales, that's completely fine. Ah, <sighs> man. Again, that, that yeah, like, I think they, to me, they just got to, they they it goes to back to exist. like it's no they have problem to exist with, in the comedy. And this is not even like a black and white thing, it's like that's an Asian thing, too, dog. It's an Asian thing, think, too. Like, I don't like, think my, race my matters. Thing is, is, as long, I think it does as long as they, I just want them to keep it. Like I, think, I think I think yes. I, I wanted to like. No, I didn't know there was a black. If you're if you're okay, adapt, I didn't, I didn't know adaptations there was a black are different man. though. If so, you're adapting yeah, something, I'd be cool with that. If, you're, if they make Supergirl yeah, I, like a tranny now, you cool with that? Supergirl, well, then it's is, not a girl. Huh? Whoa, <laughs> whoa, <laughs> ma'am, <laughs> ma'am. I don't know. Definitely, ma'am. Starfighter. Oh my god. We need to get yeah, they, the yeah, they, they, they did that, they, uh, they did that to the Teen Titans, Titans with, uh, yeah, like, with Starfire. He's a black Starfire girl. Black. But like, what's Starfire wrong with that? Cool, bro. I like, even Starfire thought, cool, I, I thought bro. that were, I thought they probably should have did that either. But because if, if, if they would have put Raven bro, as black, y'all would have said it was racist. Bro, Starfire is a fucking alien and she's orange, bro. Why can't she be black? Mm -hmm. Yeah, what's the problem? Black people is it because she was too dark for y'all? Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't know. They, I don't they know. made Cyborg like a white guy. You know, you can't just do yeah, stuff Yeah, if like they that. make Cyborg white, no, it's Why would that matter? 
too white, bro. Because cyborg in the fucking Rago, like, Honestly, for some characters, for some black. characters, race is a part of the character. You can't, no, you cannot separate it away. Well, okay, wait, wait, exact, ex, 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 please enlighten me. Cyborg is this black like, high school athlete, dog. Okay, if exactly. they make it this white high school athlete, that's fucking garbage. How? Why? There's no such thing as a white high school athlete. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the fuck you talking about. All right, man. Uh, we reached the end. We reached the end. Uh, yeah, let's end this enough. shit. Um, I, hey, tell us what characters y'all think should be black. Who? I was telling the audience to tell us what characters they think we, this should be black. Yeah, yeah. Leave it your thoughts as far as like characters you think could play. White characters or Asian characters or Hispanic characters. You think and who would you black. want to play as Braga? Listen, I want fucking <laughs> Terry Crews. I want out. Terry Crews. Y'all, ba- y'all better say That's something. Like yeah, but if, you have, if you have a Grove movie... Who are we casting? Ali, who would you want to play you? A Chinese dude? Who, niggas? Jet Li? Give me, uh, no, nah, Jet Li. <laughs> <laughs> have, have you ever seen, uh, Blackjack? Nah. Or 21, um, nah. uh, How it? High? Nah. You seen yes, that? I've seen Asian dude from How High. Yes. Who would no, you, who would you want to play is. you, Corey? I don't know, bro. Nigga, pick one. The guy that says cuz all the time in Haunted House. Oh, you know, A.P.R. Crockett. Like, yep, <laughs> that's perfect. A.P.R. Crockett. Uh, Who's, playing Who's playing Matt? Who's playing Matt? Um, shit. Someone that be taking long as fuck to make sentences up. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> no, um, right. what's the thing? The nigga from Meteor Man, Robert Townsend. <laughs> <laughs> Robert Townsend <laughs> is playing Matt. The nigga from Parenthood. <laughs> Nick from the Parenthood is playing Matt. Who's playing quietly? Definitely. Uh, who's playing quietly? Uh, <laughs> Brad. I'm to think about my name, but... Who's playing quietly? Who, who, huh? Who quietly? Who you want to play? You? No, who did Corey say? I said uh, Terry Cruz. Terry Cruz. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Terry Cruz with dreads. Yeah, who's Cruz playing Fruit? <laughs> oh, Come on, you somebody for Fruit? I'm laying now, just laying. Uh, uh, oh, uh, uh, Jonah Hill. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, I can see the Jonah I can see it. Yeah. I can see it. I, I, don't know. I don't know. All right. All right. All right. Um, Wait, you ain't say who's playing you? Yeah, nigga, you ain't running away from this nigga. I got. I don't, I don't have anybody in mind, honestly. Uh, no, we don't uh, find somebody. We ain't ending this whole time. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to you know. just like end it, wrap it up. You know what I'm saying? Uh, I can't. Uh, I Michael Blackson. Oh, fuck out of here. No. <laughs> Why are you all so racist against black people, man? Uh, how's that racist? Love yourself. Nah, no, I, I can't think of nobody. Because he's African. He ain't black. I really can't think of nobody. Either. I'm joking. Yeah, Jesus Christ. Christ. <laughs> yeah, racist hey, yo, shout, shout out to all my Africans out here, man. We, we, we love y'all too. You one of them. What do you mean? I'm not African, nigga. Yes, you are. Brado's Puerto Rican, right? <laughs> yo. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Yo, leave in, the, leave in the comment section who you think will play all bro, this stuff. We gotta come up with somebody for this nigga, bro. I don't I know. I mean, bro. if you put like Stephen A. Smith's hairline on any regular ass <laughs> black dude, bro. Yo, you know what? I'm just pointing at the Anime Expo sign right now. That's all I'm doing. I, like, I'm like, <laughs> that's all I'm doing, bro. Man, we sharing rooms. You ain't doing shit. Hey. Cause you know I'm gonna get your ass back at night, huh? Whoa! What? Whoa! <laughs> Ali, Ali gonna get blacked. <laughs> Keep fucking around. Ali's not invited. <laughs> Fuck out of here. All right, all right. Uh, appreciate everybody uh, pulling up. We, we, we apologize for being late. We'll try to be on time next week. We never did the introduction to the podcast. Yo, either. Welcome to the Grove 129 Podcast, Episode Eight. But yo, shout out to Ali, <laughs> Corey. Matt, Matt really <laughs> fell asleep. Uh, quietly, Froob. Um, we, we we were supposed to have a guest this week, but we were just so kind of all over the place. But yeah, we, we will okay, have a no guest. One get, no one can get on time. We'll have it a guest annoying, next week bro. as well. Also, leave recommendations of people you'd like to see on the podcast. Um, we had Master J. We had Sage. No, request, we had no boring Danae. people. Um, I mean, honestly, I don't care. I think anybody that comes in here kind of gets caught up in whatever the fuck we do anyway. So. Um, I guess. Uh, hey, what about that nigga on Saturday Night Live? That black comedian. Wow. Aren't they all black? Who? Who? Uh, uh, who? Oh, the guy that does the news. Jay Farrow. Nah. Nah, the dude that does the news with the old fat boy from Big Mac movie. I don't watch Saturday Night Live, so. 
Uh, that's, like some, that's like some. I ain't gonna say. But right, yo, go ahead and do that. Outro. But yeah, um, like the video, subscribe. Um, we got questions. Yo, we did get questions. But let's go through. Yo, you, but okay. Let's, let's, through no, let's say this. Let's say this. Let's, let's say this because I can't find them. If you're gonna put questions, put hashtag the growth. On the question, oh, yeah, yeah. so we can search the fucking hashtag. So put hashtag to grow oh, questions, yeah. and then we can just go that. We can have all the questions that you guys have. Um, again, recommendations for a guest. Uh, like the video, subscribe if you haven't, and we'll catch you guys later. And fuck J Cole. Oh, Peace. Wasn't Matt supposed to get the questions? I think he did get some, but this nigga said fuck all y'all. Hey, <laughs> no, no, no. His shit and he went to sleep. Once they hashtag him, we'll be able to find him. So, yeah, cool. you know they're gonna ask some. St- I had some wild shit. Some gay shit. Maybe. Shit. Like, who you want to have a threesome in the grove? Yeah, that's wild as fuck. Bro, what? <laughs>